And then I said, oh, we're live. (laughs) (laughs) Welcome, everyone. Glad to have you here. How's everyone doing on this wonderful, wonderful Tuesday? A bazaka. With that Tuesday. censored cover right there. Oh, absolutely censored. Volume 22. Who, who knows what could be behind this? And shall we find out? No. Uh-huh. no. Well, actually, I think someone was saying last week that we could look at this one. Oh, yeah? Maybe. Possibly. 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 Hello, could everyone. In chat. What it is. Uh, yes. <laughs> oh, wow. Your favorite volume, Gabriel Braga. Gabriel Braga. Braga! Yes. Dang. Curious thing I've started reading. Alita yesterday. I noticed that Mira could have been influenced by it for the Conviction arc. Oh. Right in the first volume, there are blatant similar similarities. Egg of the Perfect World part, Luca, etc. Also, the Nietzsche references. Alita is one year younger than Berserk, but the Conviction arc is newer than Alita. Mm. Ah. Very mm. interesting. Borzork. <laughs> bork, bork. <laughs> this one isn't even a spoiler. It's safe. You can look at the cover. You don't oh, really okay. need to censor it. Cool. So then we shall reveal it. This is like an unboxing, but it's it's even better. Exactly. Let's 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 tantalize them by peeling up one at a time. <laughs> Parental advisory. Ooh. Oh. Oh. oh, and then oh. you just rip it all off. Yes, okay. yes. Just just. Okay. Yeah. No. That's yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. This is this is fine. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Although although actually mm. is that okay? See see with Griffithu there. Mm-hmm. Um, you're searching yeah, for something. I'm searching for something. <laughs> I'm searching for no, something. See, see what it is, Jacob? Is his armor got an upgrade? It did, his but I'm not looks, happy about that. His so. armor looks good. Yeah, because because the thing is, his armor looks like someone who's evil it should looks, wear it. It looks like it has feathers now. Is the main difference? Uh, like yes. his armor before was very straightforward, but now it, it looks like it has feathers. Yeah, it has less, I would say, um, practicality in the design. It's going more for flair, which is... Which sure, is, yes. Yeah. Grievous! Just a bit of an armor fetish. Oh, yeah, I think I might man. like his older armor, too. More. Really? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I, I think I need to see the armor again from the past in order to fully appreciate and stuff as well because like when armor seems to look like it has a lot of mm. cosmetic stuff on there i'm kind of a little bit like mm, mm, eh, eh. you know um but who knows hey, i mean i've always loved guts as armor and oh, guts you can't armor compare guts as armor to yeah guts as armor is. is absolutely awesome yeah yeah mm-hmm. yeah for sure but yeah <laughs> prepare your bodies for this volume oh baby all right my my, my, but Hawk my, Falcon, my, yes, my, glad my, you can make it. My butthole is ready. <laughs> <laughs> Parental advisory because there is a dick in the cover. Oh! Oh! <laughs> and no, we're not talking about the massive sword. <laughs> right. <laughs> it is too large yeah. to be mm-hmm. called a sword. Uh, uh, Gin, uh, Gain Ward, thank you so much for the Twitch Prime sub. Yes, Welcome to you. the SOS Brigade. Make sure to sync your Discord and Twitch account. You can mm-hmm. get into our uh, private Discord server. Just make yes. sure to go to the sub uh, chat room and you can get right. an invite through there. Mm-hmm. Also, by the way, y'all, uh, if you weren't here... Uh, in the recent podcast or back on the witcher playthrough or what have you we've got some sos emotes not, that's right not as many as we can we're going to be adding in sub badges we're going to be adding in emotes very soon a hey, super smexy <laughs> adding uh the slow mode appreciate it but yeah go go crazy with the sos emotes in here we yes. uh we would love to know your your thoughts about them they're very uh for they're real. very, very basic for them. now. <laughs> yes, for real. Yes, for real. My you're you're a ready. veteran. You're you you're you've been around for a while. Exactly. So at this point, ah yes. Mm. <laughs> nice <Very> combination. Nice, <laughs> nice baccarets. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, indeed. Bloodhawk Law, good to see you. General S C Patton. Mm, hey. Of course. And Takasu. Chief Silver Silver George. Hey. Mesker. Drow Seven. Ah, oh, so many familiar familiar names salmon jedi that would, uh, yes that, that yes. does sound interesting a salmon that is yes a jedi. yes the mods mods are Duke mods are coming in Brazzaloi. also i found out i can do a, a cool a cool vip thing so the first person i gave it to was bloodhawk flock for just being an absolute mad lad with, with donations previously but i'll figure <laughs> out how many times i can give the twitch vip thing out 
and uh, give it out to, to more people and stuff over time as I figure out how that works as well. Guarana you have fresh... Taravana. I always dread being early enough to cringe at you two putting your grasses on. Oh my gosh, yes. Oh yeah. But, but then you have Chief yeah, and George saying, I have fresh sun grasses to shield oh, my oh. eyes from Griffisu. Yes. <laughs> All right, Jacob. Shall we begin? Oh, wait, before that, Riot nope. H gifting a tier one sub to Calcifer. Awesome. Riot H, you're amazing. What a, what a bro. Appreciate it. Okay. Oh, and Geyser TV with the 500 bits. <laughs> Missed last week, but so hyped for this volume. Okay. Oh, man. Thank you. So many people are like, 22, this one's going to be good. I'm like, okay, All right. <laughs> here we go. <laughs> so without sure. further ado, <laughs> let's put our... Grasses are no shame about shape Whether change the phrase Even mother will show you another way So put your grasses on Nothing will be wrong There's no blame, there's no fame It's up to you The choice word should be founded Whatever holds you back I can, I can get it off Tell me what, tell me what, tell me what you want I don't know why, don't know why, don't know why you're afraid Tell me what, tell me what, tell me what you say I don't know why, don't know why, too late, it's too late Ah, oh, yes, yes All right Yes, Bilyanka, uh, we have emojis now! Indeed. Use them. Mm. Enjoy. <laughs> all right. Still want someone to tribute clip all this singing in a huge video. Well. Harmonize with me, Megan. <laughs> all right. All right, that's too shrill. Volume 22. No one needs to deal with that. All right, nope. volume 22. Oh! Whoa. Oh, some... That Some special color. glossy art. Very what? nice. Subarashi. Subarashi indeed. Yeah. Oh my. Does it have some on the other side? It does, hey. doesn't it? Oh. Oh. All right. Casca holding guts and guts. Is, oh. Guts right hand clasped firmly around his sword. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's that's amazing. All right. That's really cool. I wonder if there's one on the other side. No, I probably shouldn't look. Yeah, probably not. <laughs> Just in case. Just in case. All right. First mm. chapter. Yep. Uh, volume 22. Right. Hawk of the Millennium Empire arc. The Holy Evil War chapter. The Rent World. Okay. Well. Well, um, that... All right, this, okay. this sounds like it's been passed through a certain family for hundreds of years because, mm -hmm. dang, that's a mouthful. Right. Okay. All right, let's Page go. Page six. Here we go. Oh, is this a time skip? No, it's just new characters. Okay. Oh, I think these are people just having to deal with the whole fact that Midland is under attack. Sure. Oh, fairies. Toma. And Nico. Nico, Nico, Nico. No. Um. Okay, so lost boys instead of lost children? Possibly. <laughs> okay. They're in a forest. And forests... Has eyes, obviously. I felt this way when I was little, too. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. All right. All right, that's page seven. Moving on to page eight. And double pager, take a shot. Yep. Look at these trees. This okay. is some Fangorn forest. Yeah. And yeah. Tree beard can't save you, though. Yep. That's page eight and nine. All right. Well, forest in a dream or something. It's been right. nice knowing you, children. Page 10 and 11. Yep, yep, these kids are dead. Yep. Oh, no, the mm. sounds of someone laughing. It's specifically a sound of... Whoosh, 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 whoosh. The wind seems troubled today. Nope, nope, it's giggling. There it is. 
Lovely. <laughs> Time to run. Yep, yep. The fairies, yep. here they come. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Lovely. Oh, oh th this kid's got a crossbow. What a badass. He, has, okay. he does have a crossbow. All right. Well, oh, and attack from above. Here we go. Page oh, 10 and 11. Oh, another oh. double pager. Take a shot. And a fur Zod, daddy. Zod daddy. Yeah. Flying above and with uh, Griffithu probably well, well, on, but, on top of it. But you know what I love about this shot right here? Is yeah. that because it's look, them looking up, Griffith isn't in the shot. Ah. And I, I, that does my heart a lot of good. But it dude, really that's does. a double pager for Zod. Oh, yeah. From the ground. And he's oh, flying. Oh, yeah. Like, look at that wingspan. Mm hmm. Like, he's high up in the air. And he's and his, thick. He's, he's, well, actually, mm -hmm. is he that high up in the air? His trees he's above the trees. Tall. I'd say well, yeah, at least he is 40, above the trees, though. Yeah. I'd say at least 40 to 50 feet up in he the air. He is a big boy. He is a big boy, indeed. Watch, I'll shoot the crossbow at him. Oh, and nearly another double page. Okay. This, this freaking so that's volume. What, three shots? Uh, I mean, it's not it's not a full one, so they don't have to do it oh, now. Yeah. yeah. Uh, ooh, ah! <laughs> Monster! Uh, what? Secretly, um, the hollows of trees, the ground beneath graves, the whispers of winds... The lull between waves, the depths of wells, the darkness of attics. Secretly, at some point, their silence ceased to be mere silence. Lovely. Hmm. Lovely. All right. Sure. Okay. Why not? Let's okay. do it. Okay. Things are going to wake up, and that's not good. Das is not good. That was page 12 and 13, I believe, so page 14 and 15 now. Oh. Oh, like a oh. folk tale told by elders to children, as mm. it might have been there all along. Something surely breathed within, within the silence. The sound of silence. <laughs> the sound of silence. <laughs> okay. Aww. Oh, yeah. We get Rickert. I think oh, that's might... Guts. Uh, I think that's oh, Guts. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's page 17, so page 18 and 19. Hey, and they're back, they're back. And Casca, and Casca's happy. Yeah, Look yeah. how happy yeah, Casca yeah. is! Oh my god! Okay, okay, all right, oh. all right, all right. Okay, yep, yep. They're starting it up. They're uh. starting us off with all the the, the warm feels because mm -hmm. it's going to be horrible later. Mm -hmm. No, no, it's all it's all sunshine yeah, and rainbows yeah, here. I know, Godo's, Godo's candy. dead, but 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 we knew that was eventually going to come. When Guts said yeah. goodbye, we mm -hmm. knew that we were saying goodbye right. to him as well. Like, yeah, yeah. It, but but look how happy Casca is, even in her, you know, her state. state. Yeah, yes. we're back. <laughs> Aww. I love how. I love how this uh, this stream I called it, uh, it on, the, on the post was "Guess Who's Back?" Uh -huh. Back again, yeah. and it's like, but guts, it is "Guess Who's Back." It is it's "Guess guts Who's Back" with Casca. Right. They are back. I they're, know they're together. Oh, oh. And she's crying. Mm -hmm. Yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Here we go. Mm. Berserk is armor porn. <laughs> I guess we took too long. Yeah. Yeah. So 19 and... No, sorry. That would age, be really uh, funny. Page 20 and 21 now. That would be really funny if in between the last chapter of the previous volume and the first chapter of this volume, there is a really long hiatus. So having Guts's first line be, I guess we took too long, that would be... Like, ah. If that was a thing, that would be <laughs> Is that hilarious. a thing? Tell us, guys. Like, was there a big hiatus a between Maybe volume not, 21 and 22? Oh, man. That would be really funny if there was. Oh, Murudel with the 100 bits. Let us take a moment of silence for Goto. Uh, moment of silence for Goto for being MVP and a true friend to Guts. Yep. 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 Mm -hmm. Oh, it was soon after he left, too. He was lucky enough just to see you before he died. Oh. Yes, and he found Kaska. Yes! Oh. Hmm. Hmm. You won't leave her again, right? Yep. Mm -hmm. Let's all live together here. On oh, the way that uh -huh. the way that Guts is like, like he's unable to smile because his thoughts of Griffith uh -huh. are like, stop it, mm. stop it. Mm. You have you have a wholesome, awesome thing here. Don't ruin because, it. Because because here's the thing. Here's the thing that's brilliant about this. What? By Casca also being someone that attracts, you know, the mm -hmm. the, the demons, the monsters, and stuff. He can't have the excuse of that all those dark protagonists have. I'm gonna bring my pro my, my problems to you, 
and mm-hmm. I don't want to. Right, because Casca's are also there. So, so, yeah, so uh-huh. if anything, yeah, exactly, exactly. It's, if anything, just, it's it's beautiful it's how that can, yeah. that excuse can't be there. If anything, he needs to think proactively, which means he has to take Casca with him. Or, or they could just stay here because they have a safe zone where they won't be detected. You know, what, I would, mean, be, what would be awesome? Yeah, what would be awesome is if they did like a five-year time skip right here. And then it's like, you know, they did, Guts does stay there for a, for a long time, and then something, you know, disrupts it. But, like, they have to have in his uh, Guts, you need to not leave. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, as long as you're here, even Casca will be mm-hmm. fine. We can even yeah. all fix up the cave, make it more exactly. so like a house. Yeah. Oh, mm-hmm. there you go. Oh. Uh, Zarm GS, thank you so much for the Twitch Prime resub. Glad to have you here. All right. One of the page, uh, I believe this is page uh 22 and 23 yes okay <gasps> the way casca looks back at guts like yeah yeah will uh-huh. you stay like mm-hmm. will you <laughs> and he's, he's agreeing he's like that's and true just freaks out yeah he's like really 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 it's a deal ah she's so excited <laughs> and even casca's like whoa what is this jovial this like why are we spinning <laughs> Oh, Puck's like calling him on that. He's like, can you make that promise so easily? He's like, actually, I only half mean it. Just as I got her back, you know, in the middle of my swinging, of swinging my sword to get her back, I saw him. Oh. Whoa. (sighs) The instant I saw him, I'd forgotten my urge to kill. Okay. All right. Okay, so he wants to speak with Griffith, maybe. I have no idea. I have no idea. Maybe what like, it is is he mm-hmm. needs to have, like, he needs to go confirm something, and then he'll come back. Uh, just, just but, stay, I mean, I'm stay. Just, I know, I know, I know, but, okay, so page 24 and 25. Oh, oh and that, that can't, can't be. be. <laughs> oh, oh <laughs> guts. Oh. Oh. Wandering and pushing through the dead spirit, stalking his shadow when he wasn't even in this world. Whoa. Yep. Mm-hmm. Where my sword can reach. He has hit points now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I can he has kill hit him. Points, I can kill him. Yep. Yeah. Oh, they have a guest. And it's not Rickert. Okay. Okay. Rickert's friend when he was a soldier. Hmm. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Do you no, know him? No, no, he was so pretty. Uh-uh. No, Are, no, no, oh, hell no, no, hell no, no, uh-uh. no. This better, this bet, no, this better not be a oh, thing. Oh no, if this is. I swear on all that is good and holy in this world. No, wait, this, wait, wait. No, no. Ah, uh, all right, all right, all right, Jacob. Let's 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 steal ourselves. <laughs> all right, page twenty six. And 27. Yeah, that's that's the bastard. Yep. Yep. More mm-hmm. like someone out of a fairy tale. Oh, yeah. And Rickard has no idea what happened. So that's he's, true. Um, yeah, he doesn't. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Holy crap. That's right. That's right. Oh, my God. Oh, not one of them came back. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god, Bloodhawk Flock uh. with a sudden 5,500 bits. Uh. <laughs> swift rage, swift rage, swift rage. <laughs> Someone took my spot. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> uh, I, 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 oh well. Uh, oh, thank you so much, yeah. Bloodhawk Flock. Appreciate the bits. But crap. That swift rage is basically what uh, we're uh, feeling right now, too. I never. Okay. Okay. I never expected I had this. many thoughts about what might happen like now that this had happened, now that Griffith was in this world, but ne- just how casual never, he would never, not once did this even cross my mind. And and the fact that of course Rickard doesn't know, so he's like, Hey yeah, Griffith, you're back. Oh, oh. god, please just don't don't kill Rickard. Oh, okay. Oh, and he's just talking. Mm-hmm. And Griffith is not. So let's see what's going on but, here. Yeah, that's some unlimited blade work stuff right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah seriously. Uh, okay, okay. Next okay. page, next page. Page uh, 28 and 29. <laughs> uh, double page, take a shot. Guts. 
Guts's oh, face. Reunion boy. on the Hill of Swords. <laughs> Whoa. Uh, Whoa. Double, double, page. Another <laughs> shot of Griffith. Oh, here he is. Here he is. All right, so it was it, okay. Why? Like seriously? Why? It was all going well. 30, like the, he was guts was 32, going to stay 33. there. Oh, he was here we going go. to stay Jake, there. Guts is attacking. Guts is attacking. <sighs> thirty-two and thirty-three. Oh dang. <laughs> guts. Ah, wait a minute. Oh, and Rickert's charging. Move, Rickert. And like, how could Guts possibly explain what this asshole did? He's Griffith. Like, He's our Griffith. So why? Oh, oh my god! Oh my gosh. Uh. Page thirty-three and thirty-four. That's that's not the Griffith you know anymore. Oh, boy. oh and his his brand is bleeding mm -hmm. profusely. Like crazy. Just get out of my way. No, uh. I don't understand. Oh, whoa, wait, whoa, 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 Griffith, you never change. Mm -hmm. You always swing first and talk later. No, rather, that same face, that same smile, you're the way you were when we first met. Oh, don't you, don't you, don't you I, talk, I Griffith. want to punch something. Anon I want to punch Anonymous, something. 100 bits, Griffith did nothing wrong. Wow. Yeah, just, and Morudel no, no, with no, the 100 no, no. bits, Jacob says, it was all going well. Did you forget this is Berserk? I remembered, but did, they could have done a time skip montage or something. Maybe Griffith, Griffith would have conquered the world by we've then. Got, we've got and, time to... And, we've no. got time to, <laughs> to, to move. We have to move things along here. Right. So 30, uh, I believe 35 and 36. Oh, don't talk to me in that same voice. Oh, that's cool to think about. To think about that He's talking to him in that voice, mm -hmm. and Guts has heard Griffith in the femto voice, which I think is different. Uh, did he ever speak in femto did, voice? Did, I don't think he did. I don't think he did. Oh, wait, no, I'm, I'm mixing up the Black Swordsman arc uh -huh. with being before this. The Black Swordsman arc stuff hasn't happened yet. No, the Black Swordsman arc has. Oh, it has? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. That's what Guts was referring to. Well, then he, would have, then he would have heard femto. Because remember when they were in the... Oh, the, that's right. Yeah, he did actually By speak. the portal mm -hmm. or whatever. Yeah, yep. yeah, yeah. Yeah, he spoke. So he has a different voice in that, which is like... Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh. So he came to see Guts. Okay. So all the craziness at the tower. Mm. He wants to speak with him alone. Oh. The Band of the Hawk assembling once more. Yeah. Don't, yep. don't mm -hmm. you dare say yep, that. That's name. right, Guts. That's right. You, you kill him. You cut him in two. You, you squash the pieces. Like. Wow. All right, next page. I came here to know for certain whether anything will shake my heart while I stand before you in this new body of flesh. Oh. Oh. Rickard heard that. Mm hmm. It seems I am free. Okay. Whoa, wait, 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 wait. Hold on. So, wait, 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 wait. Is this a I, I've abandoned my humanity, Jiao Jiao kind of thing? Because if nothing will shake his heart, uh -huh. does that mean he just he's just unfeeling? Like he has no I, I don't know. I, I mean, that's what it seemed to imply during the eclipse, that the yeah. last of his humanity was, you know, dropping away in okay. his tears right, or next the blood page, or next whatever. Page. And Guts is still just... Ooh. He shoves Rickard out of the way. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You mean, after what you did, after all those you betrayed, you don't, you don't feel anything? I'll not betray my dream. That is all. Ah! Oh, here, here comes, here comes Guts. Oh, and Zod protects him. Yo! Mm -mm, mm -mm. All right, rematch time, rematch time. Let's throw some hands here. Oh! <laughs> 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 yeah, Zaldrix yeah. with the 100 yep. bits. True. Griffith's true. PC be like, relax, dude. I'm just role playing my character. That is not a valid excuse, and that's why you don't. Then <laughs> General SC Patton with the 100 bits. Guts took a feat that lets him have a permanently readied action to charge attack Griffith while going, ignoring initiative and surprise. <laughs> He's readied this action for like for years, for years. since yeah. the eclipse. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Uh, but Zod is not in his um not in his re released whatever form. demon form. Uh -huh. Yeah. 
So yeah. he could lose here. I mean, well, he'll, I mean, he could. Just he'll probably just save it for a full yeah, just a just heel or some kind, you know. Right. Okay, well that's a semi double pager. Here we go. Next, next, next page. Uh, long time, black swordsman. Wait, wait. I think he was gonna say like it's been a long time, but he didn't even get the chance to say that unless he did back here. No, no, he, it's no. just long time, shorthand. Sword, black swordsman. All right. Oh boy! I love how Griffith is so chill. Mm -hmm. It's infuriating. Right, but it's 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 brilliant. I don't like the less he's talking, the better. You know what would be great? What? You know what would be great is if Erica sees this, or no, not Erica. No, because no, 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 no. See, 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 see. Just let's just keep reading, Jacob, mm -hmm. or just keep enjoying this. Oh, and Casca can feel a tremor, mm -hmm. a disturbance. Yeah. Oh, and Puck, too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He's like, this presence. Crap, 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 uh. crap. All right. Uh. Hawk of the Millennium Empire arc. The Holy Evil War chapter. The Beast Swordsman versus the Black Swordsman. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Let's go. You can't make up for this just by having Zod be here. Like, yeah, Moru Dell with the 100 bits. Mm -hmm. Steal steal yourselves oh, oh we I, have. I want to to steal s steal myself put my st steel steel needs to go into griffith right now yeah, yeah. like kill him guys but but, but but it's gonna be great because yeah, yeah, there's but, gonna be some cool yeah. conversations here all right next page next page <sighs> uh the battle continues they've locked swords the strength behind both of them is ridiculous yeah yeah rickard has never mm. seen zod before or has he no, he he saw um, he saw Zod and Skull Knight fighting, didn't he? No, I don't know if he did. All right. Like it was probably from like far away. Yeah, he might not have recognized him yet. Yeah, 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 yeah. And well, and Zod was in a different form. That's true. You did well to survive my to survive despite my prediction. It pleases me, boy. <laughs> and he just bludgeons him back like it's nothing. Oh, and he might be. Oh, he, he might, might be, be transforming. Yeah. Yep, yep. Here we go. Next page. Next page. And Griffith just stands there. Mm, oh, oh, okay. No. Okay. Okay. Nope. I guess not. Nope. It's a sword fight. It's a sword right, fight. All right. Mm. And if we forget how fast Zod is, too. Like he's actually yeah, yeah, yeah. ridiculously uh -huh. strong. Yes. He oh, is. and the way he cuts the swords that are standing there, like they're nothing. Oh yeah. Yeah. That them. is. That's yeah. legit. That's cool. That's cool. All right. Yeah. And Guts uses the disengage oh. action <laughs> to catch his footing mm -hmm. and blocks. I mean, the art is amazing. The art is absolutely incredible, but still. I'm and they, the way they simulate the motion is really legit. And Zod's actually blocking Griff, uh, but wow, Guts' attacks. Jeez. Right. Well, yeah, because even when Guts had a less than sword, it was still a problem. Yeah, use the flat of that blade. That thing will mm -hmm. take anything. Yep. Okay, okay. Continuing the fight here. Uh, good thrust nearly hits his face and okay. guts is deflecting and they're they're moving so fast it yeah you can barely tell whose sword is whose. I love the way they focus on the eyes. I love the way they focus on the eyes. The eyes are are, are mm -hmm. like yep, yep, yep. you know illuminated in the blur Ooh. of darkness. Oh, guts is going for a guts is going for a strong thrust here. Zod jumps away. Yeah. <laughs> Rickard's just like, Sukhoi, I can't tell what's happening. Yeah, uh, amazing. <sighs> All right, next page here. Magnificent. As a human, you've done well to attain such discipline. Well, mm. <laughs> yeah. Why are you with Griffin? Mm -hmm, yep. Move aside. My business is with him. Oh, words lack elegance. Force your way past. And I wonder, Skull Knight appears and cuts Griffith's head off. Well, here's something that's interesting. I think... I think Zod is... Here's the thing. What? Zod, in the past, we've seen him be kind of like a... A fortune teller, like a prophet, you know? Yeah. He, kind mm -hmm. of, he kind of just tells what's yep. about to mm -hmm. happen and stuff. But I wonder if he's kind of now found his purpose... Because Griffith was someone he knew okay. would, he knew would have great value, and now that he's seen sure. Griffith return, he's like, my like, you are my god. Like I, and right, basically, right, right. He's uh -huh. he's now yeah. he's now sworn himself to Griffith. Mm -hmm. But uh, yeah, okay, fight continues. Oh, oh boy, 
Whoa, whoa, whoa. He 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 blocked. He you know he knocked aside his sword. Okay. And he, he almost got Zod there. And yet he evaded it uh, with his yep, uh, yep, yep, yep. reflexes, okay? Wait, 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 wait. Who's 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 talking there? Is that Guts' thoughts? About uh, I think it's Guts, yeah. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. He yep. is a monster. Yeah. Oh, oh, he's he's we're going to grappling. Get the grappling oh, okay. rules out. Here we All go. Right. Here we go. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, next page, next page. Jeez. This fight is ridiculous. He keeps thinking he's going to have a a point where he can actually get a a swipe underneath his defenses and then Zod like Zod's loses the sword. Fast. He's yeah. just dodging it now. Mm-hmm. Jeez, I love seeing Zod on the uh, on the defensive for a bit here, though. This is this is cool. Oh, oh yeah, because oh. before it was just Zod is so overwhelmingly powerful. What can we kind of what what can we do? Yeah, yeah. I struggled through countless fights searching for him, and now mm-hmm. yeah, guts now is he's in right a, here. Guts is in a permanent rage mode that's yeah. giving him some insane. Well, high AC and uh, damage buffs. and you know, you know what's the worst part, though? Rolling with triple advantage. You know what's the worst part, though? Or double advantage. What? Casca was feeling the brand. Yeah. She didn't seem worried. Guts is fighting Zod. Casca's mm-hmm. probably going to come here, mm-hmm. and Guts will be too busy fighting Zod to, you know, do Yeah, he'll, anything, he'll lose right? Casca again. Yeah. yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. All right, next page. Double pager! <laughs> All you are is in my way. Okay. Oh. Okay. Look that at the, de- quite the double look pager. at the detail on the swords that are breaking around them. Mm-hmm. You have um, yep. uh, Zod's muscles. You have the little tunic, the uh, not tunic, the little loin, loin cloth. Yeah, basically. the line art as they're moving and everything, and and guts yep. gritting those teeth. Mm-hmm. Oh. All Ooh. right. Oh my God. All right. Next okay. page. Next okay. page. And Rickert's just like, what What the hell has Guts become? But that wrath, is his mm-hmm. rancor directed at Griffith? Why? Well, See, Guts did say that Griffith betrayed everybody, so... Well, well, this is the thing that's cool, though, is that Rickert trusts Guts, mm-hmm. even though Guts was the one that came in acting crazy. Like, to him, uh, he right. had, like, this, yes. wait, Guts, why are you acting crazy? Yes, that's But now true. he's, like, mm-hmm. I'm mean, trying to understand it. Why is Guts acting this way? Sure. So yeah. he's using his own, you know, intelligence yeah. and smarts to, you know, yep. solve yep. this. And Zod's sword is starting to break. Oh, it is! So he's having to grab other swords. Oh, dang. Oh, did that land a hit? Oh, because it's so small he can move it quicker? Yeah, I guess. Yeah, but yeah, will that yeah. do too much to, to Guts' armor? Like, you'd think Zod would swing that thing and it'd just snap. Uh, possibly. Whoa, whoa, wait, whoa, whoa, what was that? Oh! What? Oh, there it is! That's a, that's one of the smaller swords. He's coming in with a stab here. Oh. I think he's coming right for the face, too. Oh, boy. So Guts is going to have to dodge yeah, guts, this here. Guts, next guts, page, next fine. page. Be fine. Oh! He. He is kicking a blade up with his foot right that's on the ground and he stabs it into zod's stomach oh oh Whoa, that is awesome oh that's that legit is awesome so gut still got hit in the face a little bit uh-huh near the blind eye on his cheek there right right but he kicked that up into zod's stomach okay nice all right nice okay that's that's good Whew. Whew. yeah Okay. Okay. So they both traded a blow, but I don't think that's a that's a that's a problem for Zod. Mm-hmm. I mean, he is called Zod the Immortal. Yeah, it's such a small blade too, comparatively to him. Okay, so they separated for a bit. <laughs> that man was amazing to switch to using two swords in the midst of the attack and defense. The moment he realized his sword was damaged, but then there's Rigger giving split, exposition about split the second judgment using a sword buried in the snow like that. The instant he was driven back. Wow. Okay, so... Oh, man. All right. Mordell with the 100 bits for that sweet, sweet za- uh, Zood booty and bod. Oh, my gosh. Wow. <laughs> yes. 
<laughs> All right, next page here, All page right. 66, apparently. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. What did he say? Oh, his thump, heart beating. A, thump, a faint throbbing. My blood should have been frozen. These feelings must belong to that infant that fused into my vessel. Oh, oh no. Oh. Oh. There we go. oh boy. This is okay. Thump. I see. I love that shot though. With yeah, the, that the, is the, the divide the, between the split, their two between faces. The two of them, that is an excellent. Oh, shot. that's that that's is, just mm. that that yeah, that's awesome. Oh, that's, that's, that's just yeah. mm-hmm. so good. That is amazing. All right, that so is this is page sixty eight and sixty nine. All right, so the next mm. chapter is called Unchanged. Okay. Sixty nine. Okay. <sighs> wow. Oh. Zod's going to end the fight here. I've not yet tasted enough. Oh, here he goes. He's going to uh yep. it's going to mm-hmm. change. So page 70 and 71. And, uh, oh, the double page. Whoa. Oh, that's so Whoa. Good. <laughs> Whoa. Guys. Okay. Here he is. Okay. Here he is. Um wow. Wow. Fur Fur Daddy is uh is is here. Zod. Of course. And now Rickards now Rickards going to be Zod. like Zod. Um, Zod. Zod. that guy's helping Griffith. I don't know if I yep. can. Yep. Have yep. It. yep. Yep. Oh but my wow, gosh. that that double pager is quite a double pager. I have not yet had my fill. <laughs> Zod. No mistake. That man's not Sparatu Zod. Yep. What's happening here? Now he's looking at Griffith. That's good. Uh huh. Yep. So yep. that was page. So put it together. Uh, uh, hold on. I think uh, that's page 70, 71, 72, 73. Okay. So page 74 and 75. Oh. All right. Fight continues. Fight continues. And Guts is no match. He just I mean, knocked back the sword swipe with a. With but but he's he's but he's wounding Zod. He's wounding Zod. Where where? Oh uh, oh, on the next page. Yeah. Oh okay. Yes yes. He does he does wound Zod. Because because Zod bit. can't defend as well now. Like. Right. Zod can't defend as well, but overall, his basically his hit points are just you know quadrupled. You yeah. Know? But if it has hit points, it can, can die. Kill it. That's true. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh boy. my gosh. 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, so 76 and 77. Okay. Oh, and he hit Whoa. him with his horn. He knocked him up like oh, oh, oh. way Wait. into the air. Okay, and he landed. Uh huh. His armor is like barely holding together there. Jeez. Okay. Oh, and that's like multiple areas of motion. So he, he right, right. So he, yeah, crashed. flipping over and stuff. But yeah. Look at look at this Zod uh-huh. yep, picture that yep, yep. goes through the uh, the panels. Through the other panels, yeah. It's, it's like a three D Zod. That's, that's yeah, oh. freaking amazing. Um, yeah. Yep. Jeez. Okay. All right. Oh, he's coming. Boy. He's coming for him. Is, is that he, a, is he trying to gore him? What is that behind him? Is that a rock wall? Uh, I think it so. Is, yeah, yeah. cliffside or something. Okay. All right. So seventy-eight and seventy-nine. Oh! Oh, and he just destroyed the rock wall and everything there. No. Oh no! The mine. No. Crap. Mm-mm. Oh, good, good. Casca's not in there. Right, right. But, but still. Oh crap! Yeah, she came. She came. Crap. He looks behind him, and uh-huh. there's. There's Casca. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Yeah, we bad. saw this coming. This yeah. is bad. Yeah. Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! All right, eighty and eighty-one. <sighs> well, there's Griffith, and he's seen her. Yep. And Zod's still here. And <laughs> Eric, ah, monster! <laughs> Even Puck. Puck. Wow! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh no right. the, the the debris it's going for it's going for casca mm-hmm. she's she's gonna be fine now she's gonna be fine yeah 
Okay. And while Guts goes to save her, yeah. Zod just Zod clocks him. him. Yeah. Yep. That... Oh, and he hit his back. He hit his back against a rock yep. there. So, like guts his back. It's really taken some punishment over yeah, the years. Seriously. Like he is, he's gonna have some arthritis when he is older. Like at least. Okay. Well, he doesn't know where Casca is. Hopefully, she's okay, which she definitely is. Oh, and Griffith <laughs> saved her. Mm. All right. Of course he did. Of course he did. <sighs> Whoa, wait. So she's crying not because of it being Griffith, but she went up to touch his like his lips and his face, and her brand is like spewing blood. Just, uh-huh. I, yeah. I assume well, that's and, her brand. Right, right, I think so. Yeah. And the thing that sucks is that... Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just hold yeah, on, hold oh, on. Yeah. Next thing. He's like, stop. Okay. And she gotcha. collapses. So she was reaching for him and then... She collapses because of the brand. Or well, maybe he's not letting her touch him. Like oh, if anything, gotcha. he like pulled back or something. Gotcha. Okay. And Zod's, Zod's Zod's there with like his horn, looking like that anime hair. <laughs> um, but uh, Griffith calls him off and says, "Let's go." Okay. Wait. Is it because? Okay, I think. Okay. All right. Okay. Hold I on. Think, I think that, yeah. Okay. Let's see what comes right. next. This is all happening very quickly. Like, there's not a lot of text going on here, so we should we should finish this up. Okay, he mounts Zod. Mm-hmm. And they leave. Where are you? I told you once, I will get my own kingdom. As oh. much as I hate Griffith, that shot of him on Zod's hand right there is, with Zod is, in the is background amazing. is gorgeous it's it's blended so good all right well they're leaving and they're not taking casca yeah what is this okay all right i'm i'm yes let's all right nothing has changed ha i will get my own kingdom maybe what he's basically saying is is that because of the child that he fused with he basically does have some emotion inside him that he bears towards Guts and Casca. And because of that, he's leaving because he's like, I don't want to deal with that. That could distract me from my dream. Yes, yes. In a way that they are they are so meaningless with regards to his dream uh-huh. that he doesn't need to concern right. himself with exactly. that. Exactly. Yeah. That makes a lot of sense, for sure. Uh, yeah, uh, I wish I had a pet Zod, too. That yeah, General cool. C. Patton uh, with the... Whoa, whoa, wait, hold on. There's a lot of bits that we missed here. Oh, Anonymous yeah. with the 100 bits. Griffith continues to do nothing wrong. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Morodell with the 100 bits. This page with Griffith gives me rage. Unbearable rage. Yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. General C. Patton with the 100 bits. The it has hit points attitude can be hubris, though. This is true. Uh, the yes. Tarrasque has hit points. But without someone to cast Wish, you'll be beating it up literally forever. Uh, yes, absolutely. We but, are aware. But, yes. you know, it, it doesn't necessarily say that it will be easy, but it means there is a possibility. Right. We are like that, you know, in Dumb and Dumber. Uh Like, it's like a one in a million. More like one in a million. So So you're you're telling telling me there's there's a chance, chance, right? Uh huh. (laughs) That's that's basically what we're saying. But but there are there are those situations where the DM basically shows up with an aspect of, you know, of like primal magic or something, and it's like this is basically just the will of a, you know, of a god, basically. What are its hit points? Question mark, question mark, question mark. Right. You know, it doesn't have hit points. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it doesn't have any any spells. No, it just or spell slots. It just it just casts. You know, <sighs> it's a will. So here we go. Griffith is going to get his own kingdom. The next chapter is called Prologue to the War. Okay. All right. All right. Nothing has changed. Wow, mm-hmm. they're really emphasizing this. This uh, this moment here, Rickert. Nothing has ended. If you learn the truth and come to hate me, so be it. But if even then you can say you can you say you can still chase the dream. The okay, next page, 
I have no cause to refuse you. Whoa. Whoa. That. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Griffin's like, I mean, Gus is like, move it. I'm going to use my machine gun crossbow yep. and take and, my and opportunity use attacks. the cannon too. Oh, the cannon too. Yeah, yeah. Hopefully. All right, he fires, he misses Griffith, and Rickert's still blocking him. Oh, my God. Oh, oh my See, gosh. it makes sense that Rickert would do that, right? Because he yeah. doesn't understand. But but it's also the... <sighs> okay. Whoa, Guts is just... Guts is just breaking apart here. This is horrible. After everything you did, you say nothing's changed. Ah. Uh. You should have known this is the man I am. You of all people. <laughs> wow. Wow. Way to way to go, Mira. Like way to go to make Griffith's return be something that was totally not a, what we expected. And something where Griffith has maybe even deluded himself into thinking that he, you know, that nothing has changed. Because as far as he's concerned, he's so He's so detached from them, at least for the most part, at least for the most part, that to him, because they don't matter, <laughs> nothing has changed with him. <laughs> uh, yeah. Fee bones. If you yeah. learn nothing else from this volume, it's to tell people about your problems. Yeah. Yeah, it's like the fact that Guts never once told Rickert what happened. Well, like, I mean, higher I, I priorities. Come yeah, on. Yeah, yeah. If you but, think he's not going to do that mm. in the next few, you know. Oh, he better. Pages. Yeah, yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. All right, next page. Yep, yep, yep. All right. Yeah, Guts, tell it to me the truth. Yeah. Mm hmm. Uh. All right, well, that's uh, that's a cool shot of them flying away. Mm -hmm. Griffith's hair billowing in the wind. All right, page one hundred. Oh, his heart, his heartbeat. Thinks back to Casca mm -hmm. and holding her. Right, right. Oh, and then Guts told him. Uh-huh, yeah. Guts told him. Told him everything. Yep. He's like, that's the truth? How could, <sighs> how could that? Yeah, I am going to need a punching bag with Griffith's face. Yeah, that would, that yep. would be wonderful. Yep. Yep. That image from then, yep. Casca's no going back. Yeah, everything's destroyed. So awesome. Oh, Rickard, you're such a good boy. You're such a good boy. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. All right. Take me with you. I'm uh, a hawk too. And I yes. love that I was. No, I'm a hawk too. Like, yeah, yeah. still am. Because you never, could, you could never really hate Griffith. Oh, and Erica, is everyone uh, leaving? What are you doing? Hurry and catch her. Yeah. Oh. Oh. The party's split up again. Uh, okay. So, what are we going to do now? Well, you won't leave her again. Okay, good. Ain't we reluctant? <laughs> God, Puck, you're amazing. Like, the two branded people can't stay in one place for long was proven at the Tower of Conviction. Right. Oh, looking for other elf dwellings, but there aren't any. Yeah. Yeah, don't yeah. lock up Casca. Mm -hmm. yep. Yeah, that's yep, not seriously. living. That's not living. All right, next page here. <laughs> what is this? Since I'm the only elf expert here. <laughs> uh, uh, ding! Okay, there is a place. It's a little far. 
Uh, why didn't I think of it sooner? <laughs> oh, my home. Okay. Oh, okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. Let's let's go on a journey here. Fierce Kushan attack. Hmm, I okay. wonder what happens this chapter. Hmm. Yeah, not no, one night is too much. No, oh, don't abandon what you can't replace. And looks at mm -hmm. Goto's, Goto's, yeah, tombstone. Yep. Mm hmm. Yep. It's parting words. <gasps> All right, next page. Oh, that's a great shot. That is an amazing shot. With Casca, mm -hmm. Casca hooded and yeah, yeah, robed yeah. and uh -huh. guts walking guts with her his arm away. around her. And, yeah. yeah. Oh, take care, Casca. You better be sure to look after her guts. <laughs> uh -huh. Oh, yeah, Snow. Wow. It was Snow the last time yep. he left as well. Uh -huh. When he fought him, yep. I was going to make Fresh that connection. Start. Yeah. New beginnings. Yeah. Okay, next page. Mm-hmm. You of all people. <laughs> Casca's, like, tasting the snow. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's page 113. All right, page 114. I won't leave you behind. I won't desert you anymore. This time I won't lose you. Oh, oh that's great. That's so good. Yep. That's and so good. Cut to battle. Battle time. Uh, Kushan. Battle lines. Indeed. They're attacking. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah, they're A definitely... Double. Double pager. double pager. Take a shot. Take a shot indeed. Wow. Look at these siege towers. Jeez. Alright. Alright. That is Okay. Well. Wow. There's that. Wow. Midland's under attack. And they are woefully unprepared. Oh, and it looks like they were beaten. Executions, yeah. Oh. Dang. Oh, they lost. Yep. 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 Well, okay. Dang. All right. Executing them. Yeah. Oh, my God. And then they're just going to burn the... Wow. Okay. Are those the plagued people, though? I don't think so. They could be, but, but who knows? I think the since the Tower of, you know, thing has all been done, then... The plague's kind of over with, maybe? Sure. Well, they're taking all the women. And yeah, that's... Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, next page. What'll happen to us? Yeah, they're going to be taken as slaves. Mm -hmm. Yep. Wow. The Band of the Hawk, if only he were here, this would never... Wow. Oh, this creepy girl being like, it's coming. <laughs> the Hawk of Light is coming. I can hear it. That's what the wind whispers. Oh, lovely. Griffith's going to come in as a, as a savior coming in. and mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Is this a general or the Kushan king or? Is a general. Yep. Okay. 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 Gotcha. So they're winning primarily by the fear of their own army's strength. Uh, or at least that's what's out. keeping them from surrendering. Oh, <laughs> okay. It is keeping them from <laughs> surrendering. Huh? I'm flabbergasted, Bakiraka. What makes you a warrior clan? How absurd. Oh. Oh. Ooh. Oh, crap. Dang. Okay, so the reasons for the war might be uh, a little bit more complicated.
Okay. All right. Well, hmm. we have a lot of uh, a Stuff lot happening. of uh, a lot of uh, a lot of issues here where yeah, this I is going to lead to uh, the destruction of the Kushan. Like they are going to die. Okay. All right. Oh, and he's oh, and he's betraying them. Oh my gosh. He would pardon the urgency. And what did he did he stop short of stabbing him? I think so. But yo! Oh no, someone else shot at him. Oh, oh, someone else did. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Whew. okay. And and there goes Mira with his uh with his eyeballs. Yep. Yep. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Showing they are a warrior clan. Right, right, exactly. Yeah. They are they are they deserve catching it. an arrow. Alright, this dude does have monk levels. He does have monk levels, for yeah. sure. Alright, next page. Oh and Oh, was that a finger? What is that? Or I think a fist that's got like big Bone growth cow thing on it or something. Gross. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, there it is. Oh. Whew. Oh, that's nasty. That's nasty. Yeah. And All right, well, those guys are dead. Eyeballs are going dead. everywhere. Yeah. Ah! Ooh. Yep. And top half of head gone. Yep. <laughs> Swift, what skills? And they crushed iron armor with their bare hands. <laughs> Now we return. We now return to our m- mission of searching for the hawk. Yes, seriously. <laughs> oh, oh, and we don't have to look for him. He found you. He found you. Yep. Page one hundred and thirty. One hundred and thirty-one. Wow. Griffith just walks right into. Is he just by himself? He's by himself. Of course he is. Of course the he is. War cry of the wind, part one. He was like Zod. You'll scare the the children. Go somewhere else. Oh my god! Just the way he right. like just has no fear. That's terrifying. Eka, uh, Eka Varen Plisetsky, I guess. Thank you so much for the follow. Um. All right. So he's there, <laughs> standing proud. Bakiraka is terrified. <laughs> and then the girl's like, hmm? "Nani shore." Oh, and he just walked up and skewered Walks past them, and then just sh- kills him. Yeah, they didn't even. Wow, he just killed the general just like okay. that. Okay, all right. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yep, he's dead. Well, could you hold it a bit more this way? Yeah, yeah. Thank you. And everyone's okay. just dumbfounded. What do you think you're doing? Fire! Fire! <laughs> Wait! So they fire. Yeah. And... Oh my god. They just stop. Or or did they just go right past him? Uh, yes, I think they just went right past him. Yeah. Yeah, they did nothing. Okay. Yeah. All right. Hey, friendly. Thank you so much for the follow. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Not one arrow. Did he dodge? What? Mm-hmm. what? Second volley, fire! Oh, and here comes Zod. Wow. Wow. Zod on a horse. Zod on a horse and dual wielding. Oh, that's that's crazy. Okay. Oh my gosh. Wow. <laughs> the head's literally just flying. Yep. Yep. <sighs> what is he? What is he? Slay that man, slay him as well! And he just, nope, he just carves <laughs> through everything. Okay. Well, yeah. All right, all right. Look at the terror in their eyes. Just 
never encountering anything like this. Yeah, well, that's I gotta guess, be. I guess it's gonna be the two big guys versus Zod and uh, Bakiraka versus Griffith. If huh? they actually, I think I think their survival instinct is a bit too good for that. Maybe, yeah. They're just two horsemen. Oh my gosh! All right, next page. So uh, they just start surrendering. Yeah, they're surrendering. Yeah. And then uh, a lancer, a lancer rider kind of person comes in. Yeah, very interesting armor. My enemies, your pardon for being on horseback. Okay. My name is Locus. I have ridden here guided by an oracle. Whoa. Okay. Hmm. Oh, okay. Wow. Wow. Wow, this was all, like, foretold. Yep, twice well, foretold. By the way, Griffith has immunity to ranged weapons. We first saw this on the Black Swordsman arc when Guts fires that can arm at him and explodes yeah. before contact. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yep. 100 bits, thank you so much, Morodell. Either Griffith's immunity, ranged weapons, first time as a black sword. Yes, oh, yes. They didn't surrender. They got skewered through the head. Oh, gotcha. Geez. Oh, okay. Whoa, was that from the Lancer guy? I don't know. Yeah, it was. It was. See, that's why his. That's why there's blood around oh, the lance yeah. here. Yeah, they all got skewered right through the head. See the hole popping out here. Dang. Oh, and oh, and then look through here. It's all going oh, gotcha. through their heads over here. Dang. Oh. Oh, my gosh. Okay. <laughs> General C. Patton with the 100 bits. Wow, I guess gods really do get their charisma modifiers deflection bonus to AC. And Griffiths, who was the prettiest boy of all, those siege weapons never had a chance. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. okay. Well, Griffith is um, assembling his... Uh, his forces. His forces, yes. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, is there any way we can get that light to... Yeah, it's coming in through the window there. That's really annoying, but whatever. Yeah. We'll fill it. We'll figure it out. Okay. And he just keeps going. Him and Zod together. Just okay. He's working with Zod. Where? Yeah. Well, I mean, he's over there, and Zod's there. They're both. You know, they give each other a wide berth. Jeez. Okay. She. Okay, she's biting at her ropes. She's untying them. Gotcha, yeah. So she's running up to uh -huh. Griffith. Yeah, right. Is she going to be his queen or something? The wind whispered that the world had begun to change. Okay. Okay. Next page. Cry of the Wind, War Cry of the Wind Part 2. Zod continues just carnage, slaughtering everyone. Carnage. And Lucas, or Locus, continuing yeah, Lucas. as well. Stop these horsemen! <laughs> horsemen of the apocalypse, much? Oh. Locust, locust. Sure. You know? Yeah. Zod. And Zod would be what? War? War, yeah. Yeah. And Griffith would be just like death or something. <laughs> Wait. Oh. What benefit is there in being loyal to these? We should take advantage of this chaos to capture the hawk. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. He's incredible, beautiful. He's not like he, he's like he's not even human. End attack from behind. Oh, and they're just telekinetically held there. Uh, because of course. Hold yeah. on, hold on. We, are we sure that that's what happened? Well, I, that's let's 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 see the next page here to see what. Because it looks like they stopped. Because yes. he telekinetically threw guts away. Yes. At, at one point, so. Okay. All right. Next page. Yep. They're thrown back mm -hmm. and brought into a prostrate kneeling position. Oh, hmm. no, but there's something else. Look at this thing on the ground here. Slow, obtuse, the summit of the Bakiraka, the Tapasa. Inquire in amazement. What is this thing? Okay. Okay. 
So someone from the Kushan has come as well right, the to serve exile. Okay, to serve Griffith. You're lovely. So this oh. is death. If, I mean, if maybe got, like probably. All right. Someday I'll lop off your head and make it mine. Yeah, probably <laughs> death. Until then, I'll let no harm come to you. Oh, and now it's going to fight against these two. And it's like a spectral... Yeah, something or other. Yep. Oh. Okay. 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 All right. Next page. Oh, it's just chaos. Yep. Just people getting slaughtered and killed and madness and stuff. Wait, what? What is this thing? Wait. Some kind of triceratops looking armored beast? Okay. What? I mean, armor. I mean, armor. Armor. He looks like he's trying to be some kind of like dragon knight or something. Yeah, I think, but... I think that's exactly what he is. And he's got a big freaking hammer. Yes, that is a... Oh, that's a hammer. Yep. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Okay. okay. All right. All right. A giant Anaga? Uh, no, he's not... Oh my gosh. He's got some kind of breath weapon thing. Something in there. Maybe it's another cannon thing like Guts Yeah, is. maybe. Oh wait, here's a... There's a... There's a sound effect thing here. See that? Yeah, yeah, uh-huh. And then... Chick. Yeah, and so then, it looks like some... So okay. it is a mechanical thing. It is a mechanical thing, yep, yep. Okay. All and right. And it just killed cool. a whole bunch of people. Yeah, yeah, that looks like a cannon. Yep. Oh my There's God. an explosion in the bottom part, yeah. Yeah. Oh, mm. and now it has oh. blades. Because oh, why not? That's legit, though. Why not? That, okay, that the design. This guy's this the guy's design design is very really, extra, but it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Oh my gosh. All right. <laughs> like all strong, all forces deploy, deploy. Yeah. Oh, wait. Do you want it in the light or out of the light? Uh, out of the light. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, uh, who goes there? The squad. Yeah, the squad goes there. Seriously. Uh, what are they? What um, are they? Are those the bodies that were burned? Oh, they probably are. I yeah, I think those are. Jeez. Wow. Uh, wow. Okay. Jeez, okay. Okay, so then the little bird flies off, and what? It looks like it's a... Uh, well, it's someone. It's a dove. Yeah. And the dove goes back to someone else. Mm-hmm. Someone with a... Uh, oh! Someone with a kind of a, a wizard's hat on. See? Oh, it's, looks like yeah. A, looks like a, like a wizard or a witch Maybe or he's the other one of the squad that's not there yet. Maybe. Okay. Oh, it's a little girl. Oh, okay. Okay. Nearing that force field as a luminous body was perilous. One mistake and I'd be lost in the astral world. What? Okay. Who is this? Is the... Oh, is this an elf? It's an elf talking... Well, yeah, there's an elf talking to this girl. So is she some kind of, like, druid-type person? Maybe. Oh. Angel is the Hawk of Darkness. It's nice to have someone finally say that, as opposed to the Hawk of Light. The master of the sinful black sheep, the king of the blind white sheep. Okay. The one who shall call down upon the world in Age of Darkness. Oh, all right, okay. cool. This oh, person's got their right. head on straight. Yeah. <laughs> Wonderful. As quirky as they seem to probably be. Yes, yeah, seriously. But okay, all right. Okay. Whew. Slaughter, yep. carnage, bodies dead everywhere. But Griffith has returned. Wow, the double pager. Holy crap. And look at these. Mm -hmm. Look at these ones that follow him. Like, Yep. That's, that is quite a double pager. I just that is quite say. a double like, pager, y'all. That's, that's badass oh right there. Oh my gosh. So okay. good. Okay, all right. So good. All right. All right, next page. We were now surely in the midst of some extraordinary tale. Why do they have to, like, make the art 
with Griffith so awesome. So awesome. Like because Griffith's the main character. No, because I hate him. And, I know and he but, sucks. But but Jacob, and, but Jacob, like and Jacob. And, how many antagonists out there are better than Griffith? Like as far as like, like as far as like you know, just great antagonists. Mine is. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, I'd put like maybe Johan up there, but there's probably only about five. See, the thing is, but I still hate him. I know. That's 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 important. That's important for a lot of villains. Like, do you do you do you like? <laughs> okay but, but there's a yeah. special kind of hate reserved for griffith sure sure thing. but that's that Very makes him amazing kind of actually hate. that makes him amazing all right first act oh this is a new subtype of, of chapter of snow and flame right and first we're act. going over to serpico serpico hey with farnese and serpico oh it's nice and quiet <laughs> it truly feels like a journey <laughs> how mad yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> how so it's cold we're hungry none of it is nice i like this new farney <laughs> yes yes me too uh oh do you suggest i report to the court supreme that the holy iron chain knights and refugees were swallowed by monsters one of the vice commanders okay he's uh, an overly oh. literal <laughs> yeah <laughs> Mm, okay. Hmm. Ah, no, you don't need to worry. We can't afford Kushan or the like to show up, so I'll keep my watch. Yep. Aw. <laughs> Aw. I like that Farnese is caring about Serpico. Uh-huh, like, yeah. Like She's finally the... appreciating the other people around her and Right, stuff. seriously, because yeah. Serpico mm-hmm. is amazing. Like, yep. Yep. Give, mm-hmm. give, give our boy some credit. It was a snowy night, just like this one I happened to meet Lady Farnese. Ugh, fire. <laughs> mm. Oh, whoa, he was beaten and okay. bullied. What the heck? Runts like you don't get a share. Oh, buddy. Dang. Jeez, and this has been just basically his life. Just dealing with people mm-hmm. saying they're better than him and stuff. Oh. This is the holy city. Hmm. Oh, it's an entire it's the whole thing is a theocracy. It's it's yeah, completely yeah. built around that, built into mm-hmm. every area of society. Wow. Okay, and Serpico Whoa. backstory. Whoa. Oh, God. That's his mom. Wow. Oh, that's horrifying. Oh. Oh, Serpico. Oh. <sighs> He's an aristocrat. Okay. Oh, because of their father. Or her husband and his father. Uh... Oh. Oh, she was a maid. Okay. And... And had... Had him with the nobleman, okay. He's a bastard, okay. Yeah, gotcha. that makes sense, yeah. Uh, yeah. Pride is something that will just be the, the death of you. Like, like I know he's he's wanting to hold his head high, but it just keeps him putting him up as a target for these kids. Sorry, I have to put it near the light. Oh, okay. Sorry. Okay. Well, geez. This is this is an amazing story.
Oh, yeah, it would be a curse to him. And here's uh, Farnese. Wow, she steps on his head. Huh. Wow. So she calls him insolent and then realizes that he's dying in the street and takes him in. Right. And she will look after him. Okay. Yeah, she's probably treating him in a lot of ways like a pet. Right, yeah. I am the one who saved your life. You belong to me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Pledge yourself. Dang. All right. Okay, so he comes back to his mom and is like, you know, I can have someone come and take care of you. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Although, hearing what she said, I became aware of my sin. Whoa, what? So the house. So, the, yeah, they're stupid rich, the Vandemon house. Mm -hmm. Or the Vandemion. Vandemion, yep. yeah. Okay. And they're the nobles of nobles, yes. Um, but I was too young to comprehend such significance. The significance of his quote-unquote sin or the significance of the Vandemion house? Right, the situation. I think maybe in. what it is is that he was going to become what he hated. Sure. Mm -hmm. Okay. Obey me absolutely. Wow. Oh. I was released from those abominable days, and with that in mind, I was able to brook the somewhat unreasonable mm -hmm. commands of my new mistress. Wow, sicking a dog sicking dogs on a kid. Yeah. Oh wait, is that him? Mm-hmm. Yep. So she's sicking dogs on him. Mm-hmm. Yep. Oh. Jeez. Well. Wow. I mean, yeah, she probably started off this way so that we know how much she's changed over the years. Mm. Wow. Jeez. Whoa, all of Lady Farnese's servants are fed up with her disposition and run <laughs> off. She even set fire to one girl's dress, badly burning her. Yep. Whoa. Yeah, so she has... She has issues. Oh my gosh. Okay, so then this here, the little tyrant. Right. Left her own devices. Fitting reason as such. Yeah. Yep. Yep. So her one companion now. Yep, basically. Basically. And, basically. and to him, mm -hmm. she was the same. All right, next page. Solemn statues look down upon her, a grave and gloomy labyrinth. While there were dozens of servants employed, she would rarely pass even one of them. Whoa. And he sees the similarity. Dang. Even though it's totally opposite, it's so, so similar, yeah. Yeah. Maybe we both sense the same scent upon one another. Yeah. She has yeah. him jump off of... Okay. Yeah. Why not? Of course she would. Yep. Jeez. Oh, she's running. Okay. Oh, hold, hold on, I didn't finish that page. You didn't finish this one? Yeah. Yeah, so there's the thunder, and then it makes a, a tree branch break through the window. Okay, gotcha. All right, cool. And she runs... Oh, and this is where her madness basically sunk in. Well, all right. She led me into the woods behind the mansion.
uh oh oh even wow. at a young age she um yeah she did mm -hmm. all kinds of messed up oh oh uh, yeah and it's uh, like she's and and the fact that there's the the thing there it's the like symbol she, yeah. yeah it's like she was making Offerings to offerings, it. Offerings, yeah. Yeah, basically. Uh huh. Wow. Okay. This right. is my crematory, my holy altar. I burn all the bad ones here. <laughs> oh. Uh. The story about, about the burn servant wasn't a lie, yeah. Her smile illuminated by the flames. It was as if in doing this she intended to frighten people and drive them away. Then why? Yep. Yeah. Mm hmm. Yeah, she threw the torches personally. That's part of her story that we knew already. Yeah. Right. So she watched this over and over and over again, uh -huh. alone, one snowy day. The master of the mansion returned home. It had been over a year since I was hired. This is the first time I had seen him. Oh. Throw that filthy doll away. Gotcha. Jeez. Oh, according to my fellow servants years ago, the one time that family took a trip together, Lady Farnese nagged her father to buy that rabbit for her. It seemed to have been a perfect, oh. precious memento. The last time they wow. had actually been together. And, and the dad and he doesn't even, even remember. He doesn't even remember. Yeah. He's just like, ew, that ratty thing. Uh -huh. Get it out of here. Wow. Yeah. Wow. That sucks. Yeah. Ugh. Okay. Huh? Oh man. <gasps> I'll burn you up as well. Oh. Right. Right. She drives them away before they can leave. Yeah. Before they can hurt her, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh. This is heavy. Oh no way! Is this his dad? Oh no you've gotta be kidding way! Me. You've got to be no kidding way. me! No way! There was nothing especially moving about it for me. It was rather underwhelming. He's the one. Oh dang! Wow! Younger half sister shook okay. me more than a little. Okay. Whoa. All right. Father said that there were three men, my half brothers, each vying to succeed him as head of the family. Explained that in order to avoid any more useless squabblings, there was no way he could allow me, as a bastard, to assume the family name Vandemion. If I promised to protect the secret thenceforth, I would be granted a title of nobility, and my circumstances would be dealt with in an appropriate fashion. Wow. Oh, and he just casually mm -hmm. was like, no, I'm not interested in finding your mother. Yeah, the in time, a polite dismissal. Right, right. Yeah. And of course he would accept these conditions. Oh, yeah, He's just absolutely. trying to survive. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Oh, and he doesn't know what to do with Farnies. He, he knows she's a problem, but he doesn't know how to be a father. Mm -hmm. That was what the father who only saw her, who saw her only once all year said shamelessly. shamelessly. Oh, this is this is heavy. This is really good, though. Dang. More dealt with the 100 bits, and now you know. The threads that bind us run very deep. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Whoa. Time passed within the labyrinth. Two saplings beneath the snowy drift became bent and entwined as they grew. Without their knowledge, trees began to extend, their branches beyond their miniature garden, bearing curious fruit. Wait. Wait. Oh, she's she's kind of falling falling for him. Well, right, yeah, because she doesn't know. Right, right. 
<laughs> Serpico, be my partner. Uh huh. Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Of course. And yeah. Yeah, it makes sense. <laughs> Who is he? All the nobles are like. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not Whoa. looking for a simple salty my companion. Whoa. He's like, Serpico's <laughs> like, uh, fine, I guess I have to duel him. <laughs> oh, jeez. So she's not happy with the fact that he didn't kill him, probably. And she beats him. One, because she likes it. Mm -hmm. But two, he's probably not doing everything exactly as she wants. Right. Oy, oy, oy. Why won't you fight seriously? Oh my gosh. She bites him and drinks his blood. Jeez. Okay. When was it that, despite her bent shape, Kelly Farnies came to have feelings for me beyond those of a mistress for her servant? Well. Oh, he's fast. His sword skills are good. <laughs> this is leaves. some Hajime no Ippo. Yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh, All yeah. Right. Serpico is the best. This is so good. Oh, that's cool. When I was a child in this city, All I was right. taught to the point of revulsion that retribution is a foolishness that incurs only retribution. Makes sense. Hmm, guys. Yeah. Hmm. Oh. yeah. This is the best way to preserve Lady Farnese's honor without sowing discord. Dang. <gasps> oh, and the kids. Giving them money, yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh. Whew. Wow. I caught sight of waves, yeah. Oh. She no longer even knew I was. Oh. oh. Dementia set in, yeah. yeah she's yeah. reminding her her husband, yes. Oh. And father never once came to see her. Oh. Oh. Marriage. Okay. Okay. So she's he's arranging a marriage for her. Mhm. Mm okay. Doing it for the family. And she's all, yes, father. And then she plans to kill herself. Yeah. And burn herself alive. Jeez. Why don't you is... join the Chast Knights instead? I'll serve with you. you yeah, 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 yeah. This is uh -huh. this is where Serpico saves her. That, that's some that's some Jamie Lannister stuff right there. Right, for real. Oh. <gasps> to run away. Whoa. Oh. And he's like, so... Here's the thing. Yeah. He pushed her away, basically. Fathers, mothers, siblings. Why was I now unable to escape from all the yokes that bound us? Dang. Whoa! <gasps> she sets the house on She's fire. She's gonna burn the place. Yo! Holy crap! Oh dang! Gotcha, and he saves her. Right, that's good. Mm -hmm. That's good. Gets her out of there. Oh, and one of the mansion's houses. Okay, okay. So didn't didn't kill him. Uh huh. And of course, he he wants to keep the name safe. Yeah, the wedding's called off. Okay. Yeah. Yep. So she's sent to the monastery, right? So mm -hmm. she can be 
uh, cured Raised of her proper. evil. Yeah, yes, yeah. yes, yes, uh-huh. yes. Of course. Okay. Oh, gotcha. I was sent as well to learn about the world right. and to observe her. Undesignedly, her wish had come true. But ever since that day, there was no longing. There's no longer anything between Lady Farnese and myself but a mistress-servant relationship. Right. Because in yeah. her eyes, he, he rejected. He her. rejected her. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Oh, gotcha. Your vice commander Azan will see to all your practical matters, so you need not worry. <laughs> all right, Azan. Oh, dang. Hmm. Okay. Oh, no way. What if she instigated these fires, burning the temples? Yeah, it could be. Yeah. The diligent discharge of duty was oh, enough boy. to make even the court supreme marvel. Next page. Oh. And she just looks mm -hmm. excitedly into the flames. Yep. Ah. Oh. Yep. Yeah. The flames scorched her heart. Perhaps Lady Farnese had found the place she belonged. The fundament wow. of her childhood. Jeez, this is so crazy. Heretics, they weren't devil worshippers. They were members of a heretical sect. They protested against the wealth of the world being monopolized by the church and nobility. They preached all are equal in the eyes of God. Oh, and that was the... Whoa. That was the... Uh -huh. Wait, wait, was that symbol then the all are equal in the eyes of God, or is that the the church's symbol there? No, that's the it's got church's the money. symbol. Yeah, it's yeah. the money falling that's the, all around That's the it. church's symbol, yeah. Gotcha. Okay, so they were all killed, burned, yes. Wow, one relative and the whole family would burn. <gasps> oh... Jeez. And he's now watching who the people he once was being burned alive. And yet none of it shaked his heart. Oh my gosh. Oh. Until his mom. Yeah. Wow. Finally able to strike their headquarters. Who would have thought a sanitarium would be their den? Mother. And Farney's <laughs> heard that. Huh? What did he just say? Oh no. Oh. Yeah. Did he just say mother? Is your mother among these? And Farnese is like, um she's going to have to like kill mm -hmm. them so that they don't they don't, you know, thing there. Oh crap. Oh, dang it, she recognizes oh. him. Wow. Oh, well, I mean, she recognized him as her husband. Uh-huh, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh. Oh. Is he going to kill her? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. You throw the torch. Oh. oh. Not, not yet. Oh. Look at his face. Look at his face. Yeah. Oh, this boy. Holy crap. Oh. She knows this pains him, too. She's mm -hmm. crying. Yeah. Wow. Oh. He's make she's making him choose her. Mm -hmm. Yep, yep. The way that she, you know, was scared to have him reject her. Now he's she's making him do yeah, it. Yeah, The threat of his own life and survival. Oh, boy. Well. And then he did it. Yep. What did we burn to ashes? What were we delivered from? What were we enchained by? The third winter since then, that mansion, that holy city, is probably buried in snow again. We left that labyrinth. We never thought we would escape. 
and now we're beneath the sky of a long journey. Lady Farnese will follow that black swordsman, as if trying to melt the snow with some flame upon the snow. The footprints alone will continue on. Wow! Oh my god, what a freaking volume! Wow! Okay. I don't know what to say, guys! Oh! Like, like of all the volumes that we've done thus far, of all the volumes that we've done thus far, none have taken such a dramatic turn, yeah. turn mm -hmm. of events twice, I would say. Like, here's the thing that's the first yep. one. The first one is basically everything involving Griffith. Mm -hmm. But it's when right. Griffith yeah. then walks up to the Kushan mm -hmm. and just people start showing up. Right. Being like, uh huh. Yeah. Is it time? Is it yep. time? Yep. Exactly. And it's like, this is such Causality. a. Causality. Yeah. yeah. There's like, this, this was a moment prepared for for, mm -hmm. for, for all of time. Yep. And yeah, here we go. Yep. Hey, Zaldrix with the Twitch Prime resub for the fifth month in a row. Glad to have you here. Yes. Yeah. And Ooh. then, and then we have this whole thing with the sudden Serpico backstory. Yeah, and and the thing is, the the weird thing is that that all that stuff makes Farnese now actually seem fairly normal. Like, yes, because right? it's like, where did all of that go? Was it just the fact that he did actually burn his mother that that made her subside a bit? You know, like what? Well, I think a lot of it is that she learned at the monastery to suppress it. She she sure she, she figured yeah, there out we go. she figured there out a, uh -huh. a way to keep control of herself so she doesn't lose control. Right. She still has the desires though. Yeah. And in a lot of ways, I think the thing was is that she had to rely so heavily on faith in order to maintain a semblance well, of sanity. Well, and, and now that's gone too. Her. Yeah, yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. And yeah. now that that's been shattered, she has to rebuild herself right. from the She's ground up. Ground up, yeah. Which, which is, is wonderful because yes. if anything, that's that's an opportunity <sighs> for her to change, which is amazing. Right. Zaldrix of the one hundred bits, best boy. Okay, yes. yeah. Serpico, like Serpico oh, is amazing. Serpico is fantastic. Like, yeah. Like yeah. Berserk mm -hmm. does a really good job of building its side characters in a way that is very integral to their own plot like they have a they have a plot of meaning like they 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 really are important to their story like to not to their story but to the story of the characters surrounding them as well mm -hmm. but um they go really in depth into characters that you don't expect to and i think that on some level you only can really do that this way because it's a manga and it, maybe because yeah. it, it is a bit of a jarring like oh, jarring sudden, transition I suddenly mean, you could, serpico you could do it in a in a show too or, or in a book where you just have a chapter and then it's like and this is what we're covering now but right but it, it would it would be jarring a bit because this is a this is a pretty yeah. big world they're in so far yes. and they're jumping yes. around to a lot of places and it's people true. and things mm -hmm. oh man more with the 100 bits and now you know why serpico and farnies will never betray each other a bittersweet tale of a brother and sister yeah well the thing is i really like that she I, she still doesn't realize she doesn't that he's her brother she doesn't so yeah i i like that mm -hmm. i i like that in some ways they're like hey this is the thing where she's basically um the one you know demanding all these things about him but them actually resonating with uh the companionship that each other brings that they, they bring to the table in this relationship because of how similar they are to each other, of how alone they both feel. Right. And how, yeah. in a lot uh -huh. of ways, Farnies could probably sense that. Yes. And yeah. And the, well, just from the fact that, like, because he really is all she has because yeah. he's the only one who never left, even though he did reject her advances. Um, but yeah. And now, Jacob, three to four volumes ago, I can't wait for Serpico to kill Farnies. Maybe he's in disguise and waiting for the moment to make her pay. Um, yeah the well, thing see, is the thing is is that like it, it was hard to read serpico it's very it hard to very read hard serpico, to read serpico. And, the, and it's still something where how serpico feels about farnese is still something that i i wonder about because because he still very much protects her so he cares about her but there's the fact that she has put him through some stuff um and and like there was the whole thing of like yes he had wished you know at points that his mother would just die you know mm -hmm. um but yeah. yeah who knows 
Uh, Wyke's casual with the 100 bits. Thank you so much. What are your thoughts on Farnies now compared to before? Um, uh, I think that she turned out well, all things considered. Yeah, I think I think that Farnies is is a character that um uh, was well on her way to becoming a, an even more lonely uh, Azula. Yes, and mm-hmm. I think that that's something that. Because this is basically no one what really did with Tylee and May. Yes, yes, yeah. basically. Mm-hmm. You know, so desperate to not be alone yeah. that she would end up basically trying to chain people to her right. via, like, demands and manipulation. Hey, guys, Eric TV with a 500 bits. Thank you Thank so much. You. you have to give it up to Mura. How many other authors would have the balls to immediately give us a reunion between the primary characters so shortly after a story climax like last volume? Also, in just two chapters, he builds Serpico and Farnese an absolutely amazingly deep backstory. It <sighs> is it is impressive, I would say, how how um, condensed it is. Because in a lot of ways, we've heard about Farnese's backstory before. Uh, like portions of it, yeah. Like the like fact part- that... Uh-huh. Good, good portions of it. Yep, yep. To explain a little bit of her crazy. Mm-hmm. But in this, they gave so much context specifically to Serpico and characterization. Yes, absolutely. That's the big thing. Yeah. Because a lot of it wasn't really as much plot stuff. It was a lot of his uh-huh. thoughts and, in the middle of these right. things happening. And even with Farnese, I would say it wasn't so much characterization as it was backstory. Because this, the right. way that she was back then doesn't have much of a handle on the person she is now. Like because, so. Because she, she very much changed, yeah. Yeah. I am the angel of light, the yeah, hawk of yeah. light, indeed. Oh, <laughs> but um, yeah, let's let's answer some questions from chat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys have questions for us? Uh, yeah, Caleb, can you stay slightly lean forward so that half of your face is illuminated by holy light? Uh, the arrows are deflected by the sheer majesty of his godly presence. His charisma mod is huge. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. I think someone was saying earlier up there that that it's basically causality. Um, or uh, just his self. telekinetic powers. Uh, that too. That you too. know, like yeah, there. Yeah. Uh huh. Oh yeah, the Griffiths. You of all people should know. Line always reminds me of after he burns the queen and the nobles says, uh, the nobles and says to guts, uh-huh. "Do you find me vile?" Yeah. 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 Uh-huh. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. yeah. I think that one of the things that's really cool about this whole thing with uh griffith specifically Mm -hmm. is that griffith is a character you love to hate and then you hate to hate as well because it invests so much of your emotional energy to stir up not really to stir up but to even recall the things that he's done in fact a lot of what griffith represents as a character at some point comes back to his deeds and his deeds are ridden with contradictions and um uh and and goals and aspirations and horrific you know horrible things during the eclipse and then you have to kind of rectify in your mind that like yeah all of this was griffith Mm -hmm. all of this was griffith and the thing this wasn't you know femto possessing him right and and the and the emotional stuff that was introduced in this volume is kind of like a a way of cheesing into it a way to backpedal a little bit by uh, having him latch on to Guts and Casca's child and there being a connection through there. Well, it's all a manipulation. Like... What do you mean? Like, Griffith's presentation of this. He is, he, he is, I think, in some level being honest, but it is a manipulation. Uh, possibly. I, 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 okay. don't, I don't particularly care. Like, okay, like I, agree, fact, I agree. I the fact, that, the fact that Griffith was thinking about it internally means that it's not entirely manipulation. Yes, that's um, true. And, but, but the thing is, yeah, it's... Because, because if you think about it, that like just the fact that he was reincarnated, and now, now for all intensive purposes, the God Hand can be cut off and separate, and Griffith's here, and and he's in his regular form, he's not in his femto form and stuff. That yeah. kind of was a way of Mira to just like be like, okay, rewind. Let's like let's let's get it to like because I almost feel like it was done because he's like, okay, how do I have guts get revenge when mm. they're the God Hand? Like, right. like that that wouldn't make that wouldn't make sense, right? So I'll I'll make Griffith vulnerable, you know, by t- returning him to the, the way things were. Oh, we already checked that out, uh, Context, but thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah, we, we saw the, the, the poster and stuff like that. 
oh, can you talk about the little witch girl with the elf, Zaldrix of the 100 Bits? I'm yeah. so excited to see more from her. Yeah, there's a there's an aspect of 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 wizardry about her. Like she's some kind yeah, of something. spectral avatar right. being. She, of, she has magic. Yes, and like, but she said also that if I went into that force field of something or whatever, mm-hmm. I would be lost, lost in the, the astral, astral world, the or astral something. plane or something. Yeah, let yeah. Me, let me uh-huh. bring that part back up because that was that was yep. curious. That was very curious. Where was that? Here we go. Um, this angel is the hawk of darkness. It's basically saying nearing that f- nearing that force field as a luminous body was perilous. Uh, one mistake, and I'd be lost in the astral world. Okay, yeah. so a luminous body, I think, being some sort of spirit form, like some- the like the bird. Uh, yes, yes, yeah. exactly. Mm-hmm. So, so she. Um, and she has another elf with her, which is interesting. Well, right. Oh, I, oh, gotcha. She was. Oh, she she was the bird. That, right. She was the, the bird. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. But what I'm saying is that she transformed into the bird instead of a luminous body, or or she inhabited the bird. Yeah. Because uh, you know. The, well. Oh, you're saying that the bird is still around here somewhere? Yeah. Where is it? It flies off. Oh, it flies off. You're right. So yeah, she yeah. possessed the bird. Mm-hmm. Oh, so she was in a luminous form. Right. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And gotcha. that's why she was saying it was risky. It could have gone badly. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, so what is the force field then? Whatever is around Griffith. Oh, okay. So how close was she? Let's 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 find that out. So on the on the flag on the pole. flagpole. Yeah, so she was observing it from very, very far away. Which, very which far away. Sense. Okay. Yeah. So Griffith Griffith might have some force field of causality, maybe? I don't know. Something. Some some hoobity ha but it do what's it? something because i mean i'm trying to think i'm trying to think if the the force field is around specifically griffith or around the location who knows i mean like one of the things that i think is good here is that they kept griffith's powers Powers vague vague you know because the idea is that he's some supernatural being yeah so he's he is still a member of the god hand here like right like he has powers Mm -hmm. he causes the brands to bleed he is a being of you know darkness Uh right now he is not some like untouched new form from the past of griffith yeah he still has all that stuff oh yeah 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. and what i what i think is important to distinguish there is that this is this is griffith who took all the powers of Mm -hmm. you know the the deal he was making there sure for the purpose of getting his kingdom and now he's like i'm gonna run this thing as far as it goes i'm going to get my kingdom yep Mm -hmm. yeah so it's a pretty pretty crazy it's called plot armor uh. I mean, I mean, yes, but this is like a literal. There's a literal mechanic for well, yeah, plot yeah, armor yeah. in this no, world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I think that's just that's just cool that that's even a uh-huh. thing. Um. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The what? the I can't tell if this is the elf saying this, but it says, "Geez, Shirk, you're so tough yeah, to understand." Elf. So the elf is calling her Shirk, right? Or Shirke, or or something. S C H I E R K E. Shirke, Shirka, Shirk. Shirk. Okay, no, I've never, Shirka. never heard of a name like that, but but yeah, it's a cool oh, name. We missed we missed some bits. Okay, what do we miss? What do we miss? Uh, from Jad the Mad, Jad the Mad, hundred bits. Uh, hey, b- between this volume and the next is the events of the Berserk. Dr- is the events Dreamcast the, game between this volume and the next is the events of the Berserk Dreamcast game. It's written by Mira, so it's technically can. I recommend looking up the cutscenes. Most of it is disposable, but there are some great character moments. Oh. Also, the main villain's name is uh, Balzac. Balzac, so make of that what you will. <laughs> gotcha. You know what's funny? You know what's funny? When I was designing um, this fantasy world with my buddy, uh, with my buddy Garrett, uh, him and I created three races, and one of these races <laughs> came very close to having a, a main character in it that was named exactly that but we decided that 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 sounded too much kind of like balzac mm-hmm. so we made it Bralzac. so uh. so so i i i, lo- I love it it's funny that when you come up with like goofy fantasy they names always and stuff, be taken out of context well right but yeah. a lot of them you bump into similarly like oh, people sure. bump into the mm-hmm. same kind of fantasy right. names yeah. you yep. know yep like the faramirs you yep. know but yeah, yeah, yeah. You, okay, you saw this. Let's, oh let's... wait. Oh. 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 They meant this. Oh, never mind. I'm sorry. I now know what you mean by the other side of the poster. Gotcha. Oh, that's cool. 
That is cool. That's very cool. I think we can show this, right? Because it's not a part of the the manga, right? Uh, can we I don't show know. This? I mean, it is a part of the manga, but I mean, but it's not a part of the 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 like the chapters or something. But it's still part of it, so I, mean, I don't know. Yeah, I guess yeah. maybe not. Yeah, um, maybe not. just in case. But let's 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 scroll up through through chat. To... Because now we're actually done with the volume. Brr. Okay. Um, Do you want to go up even further? Oh, it can go up further. Cool. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so it could be that the burning day for Farnes or, and Serpico was in the same. Oh, the turning. The turning point. day was the same winter when Guts left the band of the Hawk. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah. Hey, that's I mean, a possibility. That'd be cool. Yeah. Uh, Farnese's upbringing was pretty messed up to begin with. Both her parents being absent, the servants not doing much, if anything, yep. substitute parental figures, mm. and so on. Wait, wait, hold on. Hey, at least one of them knows that they're siblings. Wait, wait, why is... Why is te it can only go up so far as the thing. Oh, it can so, only go up so yeah, far, that, yeah. dang. Uh-huh. Uh... Okay. Yep. Gotcha. Um... Caleb says, I'm the Hawk of Light while wearing a freaking belt. <laughs> uh, Serpico was desensitized due to his childhood. Totally makes Farnese sense. Farnese action barely faced him. him. Yep. And she was the sole thing that linked him to his own humanity. They're both a mirrored version of each other. Both of them can't survive without each other. Right, yeah, Absolutely. It, it makes sense, yeah. Oh, dang. Uh... Okay, so context, we did end up looking at the other side of the poster. Right. Thank you for letting um, me know about that. Uh, Griffith and Guts, top tier villain versus hero duo. Yes, Absolutely. For sure. Top, top mm -hmm. tier. Hypothetically, if Griffith ever did something wrong, can he do anything to redeem himself? <laughs> well, that's the, the interesting way to phrase it. Um, <laughs> that's funny, though. Um yeah, it's Griffith's fault that the demon baby even existed. Don't right, forget. because otherwise oh, it would have just been a wholesome natural baby. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. Um, uh, how is his backpedaling? This was all a part of Griffith's original plan. No, no, no it's not backpedaling as far as uh, as far as Griffith goes, because his his goal was always to get the castle. But the fact that he couldn't get the castle in his ascendant form um, is kind of backpedaling away from the whole aspect of the god hand and them being set up as this right i think it's giving him the illusion that this is his control he's deciding yeah this maybe or or just uh, or from from it certainly makes things easier for guts let's just say it's I, still going to be tough but well you know. I, I think also we're we're not meant to like think of it this way Th there's all the the like the freaking like you know biblical stuff here but he's basically the wolf in sheep's clothing oh yeah yeah absolutely he, I, he might look like this but mm -hmm. this is basically the equivalent of his non right. transformed L demon let's, form. let's just know? say that i was way more looking forward to oh my god how is guts going to say stand up against the god hand than how is guts going to stand up against the squad that griffith's formed the squad is very cool right but like that was just one of those things where it's like oh i guess now they don't have to actually have any further interaction with the god hand like they, they just don't because griffith's here right so <laughs> wait wait it's objects of the 100 bits now that you're here did griffith tape casca just to get a new body later causality and all that i mean i suppose you could say that but really if you think i'm not going to go it, into griffith's why for doing that because well, we talked about that a lot in a in, and also, like, yeah, you could say that maybe there's some causality stuff, that, which is why it happened, you know, as a whole. And oh, Griffin's sure. And will and, you know, all that stuff. But why the fact that he did the the eclipse thing and all that. But, um, but, but, yeah. one, of the, but one of the things that I wonder about is, did it have to be the, the, the demon baby? Like, it, why couldn't it have been anything? Because Griffith, like, I guess he had a tie to that demon baby because he corrupted it. But Right. Oh, yes, Vanilla Debt. Thank you. It's interesting they introduce a girl who appears to be a wizard who can interact with the astral plane. I think at one point you two wondered what good was out there that could compete with the magical darkness of the god. Right. Man. Yes, yeah. and I think this is going to be our eventual kind of tie mm -hmm. into that. Yep. She's probably someone who's not, you know, pure good. She's probably someone that has a tie to good uh, 
about stuff, though. Sure. And it's probably something where she's good enough that Griffith is someone that, like, eh, no, I don't mess with that. And I don't think that she's necessarily going to be weak. I just think that it means that it's, like, she's so good, she can't be that presence against something so evil. You well, know? well, or to, to put it another way, uh-huh. there is no reason that Guts should ever be able to defeat Griffith with Griffith's powers. Right. He needs to have allies. He needs to have allies. So, and I'm, I'm yeah. all for Guts being the battle commander again. Like, can you imagine, like, oh, Guts yeah. eventually well, leading the, like the fight well what i was like armies on armies you know what i was hoping mm-hmm. is once we saw this chapter and that they were reunited was that they would do a time skip you know a short time skip uh-huh. griffith would because uh, of course griffith's gonna conquer everything right um griffith would conquer everything and then there would be a point where it would be a problem that couldn't be like ignored anymore for some reason you know the cave getting destroyed or something like that right yeah um and then guts basically is like you know older and saltier and all that stuff and you know like grizzled and stuff and and then he he has to then be like okay now is the time to to, yeah. to start the the end. Um, he turns the brands into blood fountains, not just bleed. Lol. Yeah, yeah, yeah basically. Uh-huh. Uh, do you think Griffith pushed Casca away so she wouldn't bleed out? Um, I, I think mean, that possibly, I th- but I, I don't think it was anything as selfless as that. I think it was just the fact that he's like, there's something that I don't understand about myself and I don't mm-hmm. like it because I'm a, I'm a God being right yeah, now. I think he was scared of the fact that his heart started to beat exactly. Yeah. When he was mm-hmm. closer to them. Yep. Cause I feel like so in the same way in that they have a weakness against the mm-hmm. monsters coming close to them and it gives them pain. Uh-huh. I think Griffith Griffith has gets a weakness pain, them, which is a great from parallel in close. duality and stuff. Because I because yeah. okay because the real question is why did he go seek out guts? Right? He said it was to see if he if there was anything left in him. Right? Mm-hmm. Um, and there and it turns out maybe there was you know or or it or it came back again or something like that. Right? I think it's also the familiarity. Uh, maybe, but but there was but there was there was he 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 stated that there was very direct intention behind it, right? It wasn't it wasn't because of him caring about them. It was about him wanting to see if he co- cared about them, right? Um and then it turned out that maybe he did and then he's like, "Okay, well, I can't have that." Yeah. Yeah, nothing has changed, yeah. Right now in what spot would you put Berserk in your favorite stories ever? Oh, I don't know. You I would say you can't really rank them because the thing is that then you're you're having the rankings surpass the styles of the stories. Mm-hmm. And and it's really yeah. tough to compare because it really is based on what mood I'm in for, for yeah. most stories. Yeah, missed me bits. Okay, we, we did get that one eventually, right, yeah, Jad yeah. the Mad? Yeah, we yep. did. Um, um The elf was asking why the witch possessed the bird to look at Griffith, and she responds that approaching as a luminous body would have been dangerous, thus implying that she was using the bird as a safer option. Yes, Mm -hmm. yes, you're right. Um, Um, More with with the 100 bits. For the sweet artwork on this volume that came with an amazing battle between Zod and Guts and some stellar backstory for two characters. Yes, that was yeah, this is a, amazing this is a, artwork. This is a packed volume, mm-hmm. despite actually having so much of it in just that combat. Like, yeah. Like, there yeah. was no real dialogue story there. And the weird thing is that there's a part of me that actually doesn't like it when Berserk goes into not not fights necessarily well uh, kind of but like duels and action and stuff because the art is so amazing i kind of want to like like i feel like it can feel sort of the same when yes. when it goes like in like duels like with with guts yeah. and zod but then it'll have those like shots where it it, it does the shots and it's like exactly. okay all right Ugh. um you always read it sheer k how it's okay. pronounced we will never know yeah 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 uh shirk 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 yeah. Shir khan. <laughs> yeah. it's griffith's fault yeah yeah yeah, yeah. we just read that um since her name is a reference to a german village known for sorcery i pronounced it german style oh. or japanese trying to pronounce a german <laughs> cool so which one is that uh. it's funny how jacob doesn't even like discussing about griffith ah well i just we don't like I griffith hate him. yeah uh, it's Griffith's fault. Yeah, yeah, they, yeah. Someone's spamming here. Uh, would you preserve your top ten stories of all time? I don't know. We haven't Tough finished to say. it yet. Like the yeah, well yeah, it, we haven't finished it, and how it finishes is is a big deal. Um, but the 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 characters are absolutely fantastic. The art is yeah. unreal. Um. Uh, da 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 da. 
Man, Griffith mm -hmm. sure is lucky his physical form is his insane fantasy like pretty angel boy and not some disgusting uh -huh. apostle yep. monster. I mean, hey, that's maybe just part Being of the magic. Being the god hand, right? you know? Yeah, yeah. Uh huh. I mean, the God can can't truly exist in the world to have a kingdom without being incarnated. But the thing yes, is, is that that was true. something that was something that was not known really until recently, and we had seen the God Hand manifest in this world only during so, the eclipse. No, 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 not even during the eclipse. Like the other stuff where in the places of great evil. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the thing is, is that yeah. you know, so so there's there's a way that it could have worked, right? And and, th and they ended up doing something else that removed the God Hand from the story. Yes, but so. I think I think that. I think I'm not that, saying it wasn't a good idea. It's just something where, like, I get the feeling we're going to get a lot less of the God Hand moving forward, which makes me a little bit sad. Yeah, I think I think that's actually good because the grand conflict should be between characters that we know and the God Hand are not characters. They're, 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 they're forces of... That's why I was excited to get to know them because yeah, 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 yeah. they could all have backstories just like Griffith. And yeah, but they're, they're endgame. They're endgame. But they might not even be endgame. I, I, they are definitely endgame. They don't have to be, though. I, I know, but they, here. they are definitely endgame. Like, okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. We'll have to we'll have to leave that for yeah. when slash if Berserk actually ends. Yeah, exactly. Um, slightly still on topic, by the way, there's a Guts vs. Zod fight on YouTube made totally from Berserk game cutscenes. Oh. oh, that's good hmm. to know. Do you enjoy the heavy inverted symbolism and the fact that Guts is the hero... But is the black swordsman and looks frightening. With Griffith is the white hawk oh, yeah. of light mm -hmm. and is considered by some as the hero, the little girl, for instance. Yep, yep. Oh, oh, I yeah. love that. Uh -huh. I it's, love that. Yeah, it's sickening. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Fun yep. fact: the Berserk game had a Western localization before the manga and anime. As such, it was titled "Sword of the Berserk: Guts's Rage" hmm. instead of its Japanese title, "Berserk Millennium Falcon Arc: Chapter of the Flowers of Oblivion." Millennium Falcon Arc. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice. <laughs> uh, Griffith returned to confirm his feelings. He said so in the volume. Right, he sees exactly. All his comrades' graves and says he feels nothing. But then when he sees guts fighting, mm -hmm. and then when he saves Casca, he starts to feel a little bit. Interesting thing to wonder is that what was it the kid making him feeling that? Or is it him actually feeling guilty, maybe even a mixture of both? Right, and he doesn't seem to fully know himself. So he's, he's scared know, he's of wondering. it. Right, he exactly. Leaves. So he leaves. Yep, yep. yep. Mm -hmm. Um. Uh, by the way, Hawk and Falcon are the same word in Japanese, so the arc is meant to be read as Millennium Falcon. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 we got that. Uh -huh. um, Egg Apostle became the body. Baby just happened to be around and got fused. Right. Griffith mentioned that. Yeah. yeah, Griffith is a dick. Now he's Casca's kid, and we can at least be happy that he won't do that again. Please, for the love of everything, right in the universe. Yeah, basically. Uh huh. Oh my gosh, yeah. Yeah, this has been this has been crazy. Oh, nice, nice. Thank you, General C Patton, for the one hundred bits. Adventuring party mark two. We have a caster and a healer now. Yeah, basically. <laughs> yep. Yep. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, that's that's funny. I, yeah. I love that. Uh uh yes that is a good point griffith slash femto from volume three and now is pretty different from the way he acts absolutely yeah very much so yep, yep. Mm -hmm. um i'm just being cautious did you guys notice the couple lines of dialogue in the very first chapter title page that said that children were noticing changes in the world. Oh, yeah, I wasn't yeah. sure if you read it or not. The text is pretty small. Right, and yes. that's probably all a result of the fact that Griffith's here now and, you know, and whatnot, yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of movement and things that are basically coming to bear because this is a moment of fortuitous, you know, convergence or whatever for yeah. the fate of, you know... All that is and will be. And we got a little bit of wholesomeness this episode. We did. This volume. Like, with Guts and Casca. And then immediately, it was just yanked away. Yeah. Why did that have to happen? The shadow proves the sunshine, jo though, Jacob. Yeah, like, but it's all shadow. And <laughs> no, 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 no. Casca like, hey, wasn't taken. Casca like. wasn't taken. That's true. Casca and true. Guts are That's together. True. Yep. Like, can you please let me have this? This is this is a, yeah, this is a very wonderful thing. That like, is, yeah, yeah. The, yeah, that is pretty great. It is, is pretty good. Incredible volume. It is oh, yeah. interesting Absolutely how, fantastic volume. how the volumes, I don't think they're necessarily getting better and better every single time. I know that the art is definitely getting better and better mm -hmm. over the, like, it is trending better over the course of the volumes. But, like, there are certain sections of volumes where I'm like, like, this is just so good. 
like this is this right here is just amazing Mm -hmm. and then in other times i'm like oh this is good stuff and then i'm like it's it's all so incredible and kind of bewildering that i feel like i'm not able to give you guys a perfect representation of what i'm experiencing internally when i read this because a lot of times i don't know if it's like this with you guys i know jacob you and i are very Mm -hmm. similar in this regard a lot of the good thoughts that you'll have about these kinds of stories and stuff happen like randomly like on the toilet in the shower when you're about sure. to sleep and stuff uh-huh. and you're just like <gasps> and then Whoa. you just randomly tell uh-huh. me or something like caleb da, 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 da. i'm right. like what i never uh, mm-hmm. what that's so cool yeah. how and i i think that i think that this story is so intense so graphic so um <sighs> so big draining and draining and and hard to read that a lot of those big kind of whoa moments happen mm-hmm in the time after you know they happen in the sure. time after so well yeah because like i mean yeah. it's it's exhausting to go through the berserk like it's fantastic but jeez. and thankfully we don't Ooh. have any more like really ridiculous mm-hmm. stuff anymore well, <laughs> Wait, i mean what are I mean, you talking about no sorry in the more recent volumes yes it's been a little bit more true. sane i would say in by recent like the last one or two yeah yes yeah, yeah yeah or or so for sure. um yeah oh, i'm excited man. for them to go to to Puck's home, that'll be great. Yeah, Puck, gotta love. It'll be Puck. absolutely awesome. Uh. Um. Also, one of Guts and his fake arm influenced by Godfrey Guts von Bell. Oh yeah, Bell. Yep. Mm-hmm. Also we've, known as we've Guts We've been told about that. Oh yes, yeah. yes, that's right. Yep. Mm-hmm. That, we got told about that back in the anime days. Yeah. Puck the God Hand. Oh my gosh. Oh. Uh. Uh, polymorph man it's a useful spell <laughs> nice nice we're gonna be dead by the time berserk finishes nice mm. uh getting near tpk with an all-fighter barbarian party is a painful lesson gotta balance that party composition yeah 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 it is uh-huh. for sure eric walt with the twitch prime sub thank you so much bro. thank you glad and, to have you here and as for the whole question i, I saw it up above i think recently oh, a ways it? back i can't remember but it was do you think griffith can ever be redeemed Here's the thing. Oh, is it possible for Griffith Griffith to be redeemed? Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, Here's the thing. I mean, anything's possible, but I don't want that to happen. Here's why. Here's why. Mm -hmm. There was so much of Berserk that was basically, if you think about it, that's build up. Now, now it's not that it's only there for build up because the stuff that happens is absolutely incredible. Everything in the Band of the Hawk, amazing, right? Mm -hmm. Like The whole journey up till now has been absolutely stellar. The thing is, is that things like the Eclipse happened. And that's a big story shift, right? So what I would be a lot more interested in seeing is not Griffith being redeemed, but Griffith maybe maybe being a little bit um maybe a little bit like regretting what he did. Yeah, but Griffith having some internal, internal thoughts regrets, and feelings. That's fine, right? Internal just, thoughts and feelings, cool. Just yeah, but the thing is ideally where I would want to see that go is him being like, wow. I guess yeah, I actually did that. Well, too late to go back now. Yes, you know, like doubling down, like, basically du- realizing down all the way. He, yes, if he ever has any doubts, mm-hmm. if he ever has any doubts, he would do the thing of like, well, then I better make their sacrifice uh-huh. mean the most it could exactly. possibly have. Be- and I yeah. think that's a very yes, Jacob, mm-hmm. very cool complex aspect of his character because is that he yeah. is aware that that stuff is something he did, right. and that he thinks yeah, it was the right choice. It was the right mm-hmm. choice. But if he ever has doubts about that, I want him to double, triple down Right, on it. because yes. that that's something like, because that was one, why he, like how the God Hand convinced him to do the Eclipse anyways. Right. And as for a way to convince him, I think that was absolutely fantastic. Was yes. there some sort of mind affecting stuff in there too? There could have been, but there doesn't have to be, right? Yeah. Because he was brought to such a low point. And yeah. now with where it's at, yeah. I, I want it to be something where it's not that like, basically, I don't want the Siler treatment. Now, no, no, I don't no, think no, no. that this, it would never this, go this anywhere story is near way that. Too it's good. so far beyond don't even that, right? Compare. So oh, far beyond, man. right? Right, yeah. so far beyond. Yeah. But the thing is, I because of how much weight is behind all the stuff that has happened that Griffith has done, mm-hmm. right? Yeah. If he were to basically lose sight on his ideals as much as I hate him for the things that he does in service of those ideals, right. then it would feel like a slap in the face and an insult to all the 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 horrible things that happened along the way. So, 
Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Fereo says in the sub room, uh, remember to check stream highlights uh, on Discord. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> nice. Oh, boy. <laughs> okay, we'll, we'll do. <laughs> All right. But, um... Oh man. Yeah. Puck's home. I mean it's it's gonna be it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be fantastic. Assuming they're able to get there in a reasonable amount of time. I mean, like, cause you know, who knows, like guts just making the journey with Casca and needing to keep her safe and stuff at night and all that stuff. It's gonna be crazy. It's going to be um nuts, but yeah. but yeah, it will be absolutely fantastic if slash when like when, of course, because they're going to get there eventually. Otherwise, why would they bring it up? But Oh, I think it's really fun yeah. that Zog basically gets demoted to Griffith's bus boy, just like Guts was in the Band of the Hawk. You know what's funny? Yeah. I think that Zod, um, I think that Zod, while he might not be doing this, you know, thrillingly, I think he respects in some way that Griffith is going to take this world somewhere. And Zod has just been out and amongst the world. Like it's it's a weird thing to think about, sure. but it just Zod has been mm -hmm. Zod's been out there. He's built his own real legend. He's he's not even trying to be some right, crazy yeah. guy or whatever. He and, and he seems to be somehow immortal of, of some kind or right, something. He, we don't know what he wants necessarily, mm -hmm. but we've seen him multiple times go against the God Hand's wishes. And you know what I'd really like to see? I I would really like to see him at some point kind of give a little bit of a did he ever go against God Hand's wishes? I mean, no, not necessarily directly, but he didn't. Um, like, like he, whenever he was doing something, and he's like, "Oh, he didn't God stop Hand. Skull Knight." Well, but I think that that was because Skull Knight just handed Zod's ass him. to him. <laughs> I mean, <Yeah>. okay, <laughs> okay, but what I would like to see is maybe at some point him and Griffith have a talk. Oh, don't forget Zod, Zod lost to Griffith just like Guts did. Yeah, when Griffith took out the, the oh, horn yes that's yeah. right uh -huh. that's right zod yeah. is sorry zod is then in survival just instinct just yeah i mean keeping himself you know, safe he, he you doesn't know? seem to mind it too much but yeah uh-huh for sure hey ryan age with the twitch prime resub for the fifth month in a row and that reminds me y'all uh, i'm working uh on getting those sub uh badges up so uh get get hyped for those those of you that are subbed for three months and then I guess the next one will be six months. You'll be getting a you'll be getting a cool thing for that pretty soon. Oh. But uh, uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Ramiz, if you people think Griffith is gonna be redeemed, then they are crazy. Mira won't ever do that. He's just a facade, aka the Hawk of Darkness, disguised right. as the Hawk of Light. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. and I, I think that the idea of Griffith bringing about of Age of Darkness because his dream is worth any cost mm -hmm. i think that's, is is compelling yeah, like that that is that's, very compelling and i'm yeah. all for that it's just it's just i i just want there to be like a, a 50 mile like like radius at all times minimum between him and casca like i that's I, no way going to be maintained i know but There's the thing no is, is that like uh in some ways i actually think jacob this is a weird thing to bring up casca might be the way to stop him Casca might not be the way to stop him, but Casca might be safer <laughs> with Griffith than with Guts. Oh, sure. Yeah. Like, I don't think that's... I don't... She would also be safer in a cage. Yes, yeah, she would also be safer you know, in, in an elf cave. Probably the, you know. elf, uh, yeah. Yeah, the elf cave and stuff like that as but, well. So, yeah. yeah. Yeah, we'll just we'll just end up oh. yeah, finding out that stuff there. Yeah. Oh, don't worry. We can't read earlier chat and stuff like that because it just doesn't let us. It doesn't scroll up that far. So, yeah. yeah. Zod is behaving like his Soka from Hunter x Hunter. Oh, yeah. I mean, he, he is a power that. sexual yeah. for sure. And oh, I don't think Zod is in survival mode. I don't believe he's that type of character. It's more about respect he holds for the strongest. Well, right. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, call it what you will. Yeah, but it's yeah. No, him. he has respect for Griffith since Griffith thrashed yeah. him. And yeah, and, and he has respect for Guts in a lot of ways because, you know, Guts is while being a mere yeah. human you know he's doing all this stuff <laughs> caleb you shut up i'm sorry i'm sorry <laughs> i'm sorry it's a weird thing to bring up but i think in some ways yes casca might be the thing that is the undoing of griffith mm -hmm. because he felt something by being close to her and by being well and hearing you know guts's words and stuff. sure so yeah. what if it's a thing of where it's not that he gets redeemed and it's not that he doesn't achieve his dream, 
but he achieves his dream. He gets everything he wants. And it's still not And enough. at the end, he realizes, like, that, mm. you know, it's, it's, yeah. it's not, it's right. not, it's not worth it. Maybe it's not a doubt thing or where he regrets it or gives it up. He realizes it's all he really has. And maybe, if anything, he regrets remember, remembering how he said that, I almost gave up my dream because of you guys. Right, you you made me forget my dream. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. And he remembers that that happened. And he realized he could never get that back. Sure. And then maybe, maybe, maybe in, maybe in his own hatred and depravity, maybe in his own unfeeling aspect of that, uh-huh. he realizes that Guts being alive is mm-hmm. too painful of a reminder. So he has to kill Guts. And that's how it ends. And Griffith oh, is killed. okay. And yeah, I think I think it would be cool to have Griffith die in Guts' arms like that, you know, like in that way. Like maybe, you know, Guts uses, you know, some way by which that could actually happen. Once they actually figure out a way to defeat Griffith because there's well, no yeah. logical reason that he should at this point. Yeah, yeah. well, I mean, if uh-huh. we're if we're going to get into a battle of that level and stuff like that, we're going to need all kinds of magical hoobity ha and craziness before right, right. we can even mm-hmm. go close to that. But mm-hmm. like Griffith being you know incarnated in this world gives me a lot of a lot of hope that he you know he will kill griffith in right. the end oh yeah that's that's the main reason that i that i don't like griffith and casca being near each other is because casca now has an attachment to griffith when she doesn't ah, right when because she you know sees him as as kind of her child, her child sort of yeah even after everything that happened and well, because um, she's well, right, 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 yeah, right. But even then, but yeah, but she still has like she still doesn't like seeing guts a lot of the times. Yeah, she has and, PTSD, you know, and yeah. and she'll have PTSD flashes to a lot of other things, but not when she actually sees Griffith. Um, and yeah, so it's just it's it's just all oh. all upside down and twisted and wrong. Oh well, yeah, well, that's not a no, that's, yeah. My my idea was dumb. Okay, well, y'all, this has been. This has been fantastic. Wait, I gotta read that. Leaf Casca in the safety of the elf dimension within the great house of Keebler. Free cookies are the best therapy. <laughs> with with that, let's call this one here. Thank you all so much for coming to the stream and watching us deal with the monstrosity that is Berserk and its incredible manga, beautiful art, and fabulous story. Thank you all so much for being here. Uh, come join us again next week. 3 p.m. Pacific Standard Time on Tuesdays for more Bazaka. Yes. And uh, Thursday, 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time is Divinity Original Sin 2 uh-huh. co-op stream. Yep. Friday, 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time is me playing The Witcher 3. I'm having a blast in both of these games, but just goofing off in Witcher 3 is pretty pretty fun, pretty hilarious. Uh, Monday, 3 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, we have our podcast. Right. Where we talk about anime, hang out, do kind of stuff. Q&A, chat. All that good stuff. Jet, one last thing. Jet the Mad. This is the Millennium Falcon arc, and Zod is a goddamn Wookiee. I'll never let this joke go. <laughs> yeah, he kind of is. Yeah, yeah. Oh, boy. Yeah. Oh, boy. <laughs> all right, y'all. Well, but we'll uh, see you all thanks for tuning uh, in. on Tuesday. But until then... It is or, Tuesday. Oh, no, no. I meant uh, in the next stream. But okay. until then, we're Semblance of Sanity. I'm Caleb. I'm Jacob. And we'll see you all next, next time. time. So, what shall we uh, talk about? Uh, what's talk? Battle Lines again? It's the most amazing book <laughs> ever. Yes. Battle Lines. <laughs> oh, man. There's not much time, actually, on the Kickstarter. So, y'all That's should true. check you that should out. Check it out before it's Jacob, over. Jacob, what's like a awesome. really good, like, spoilery thing to entice uh, spoiler and thing. Well, okay. Lines, so, so you know? the thing is, Battle Lines is kind of like if you take the... Uh, the whole post-apocalyptic revolutionary, mm-hmm. you know, row, row, fight the power thing. 